Hey everybody, welcome to hello. Saving Throw. Hello, hello. 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 Tonight we are doing the final part of a three-part series titled It's Always Cloudy in Barovia, which is a fifth edition game where we play through um, a little bit of Ravenloft, which is the gothic horror setting in Dungeons and Dragons. Um, my name's Garav, and I'm gonna be the Dungeon Master for tonight, if you guys are okay with it. I hope you're okay with it. Um, Don't vote me out now. It's just, a little late. We didn't get a chance to discuss that. Yeah. Let's move okay. on, great. Okay, high roll uh -huh. these days, okay. low roll. Mm -hmm. uh, high. I mean, that's, high high that's on the high okay. end. That was a four. Great, I'm yeah. gonna stay. Uh, let's meet our beautiful players. Um, let's start oh. with Jesse. Oh. We'll start with you. Hi. Uh, tell them your name, and yes. then your character's name, and then also tell them has your character ever seen a ghost? Whoa. Oh. I'm Jesse Hendricks, and my character is Grizz Cragholder. I'm a mountain dwarf from um, Daggerford. It's my cousin slash brother. Don't ask. And, <laughs> um, oh, my character's seen a ghost for sure. Oh, she's seen about three. It was all in the same night, up upon a hill, when she was looking down at a bonfire, and there was a whole group of people around, and I saw these ghosts coming out to the woods, and I was gonna say something, but I don't wanna say anything. So I just ran away, but I know they were ghosts. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. And next to you we have... That is a terrifying story. Me? <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, I'm Dom Zook, and I play uh, <laughs> Ferk Craigholder who is also a mountain dwarf from Daggerford. And uh, what else? He, has he seen a ghost? No. <laughs> <laughs> you sure? Yeah. You sure about that? Pretty sure, yeah. Okay, all right. The ghosts aren't real, so why would he see one? Definitely not, definitely not. Absolutely right. Let's go across the table to... <laughs> no. <laughs> Mr. Laughter here. Ah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm in a mood tonight. My <laughs> name is Tyler Rhodes, and I play the character of Mirko Bulgash. Mirko is a young wizard um, with a troubled past. Uh, has Mirko seen a ghost? Has he? <laughs> I see ghosts every day. Oh, nice. Sometimes oh, wow. multiple times a day. I fight them off, but they keep on reappearing. They haunt me. I'm a haunted man. I believe that. Yeah, those are memories. Yeah, that, that sounds about right. <laughs> that sounds about about what we expected from him. <laughs> You've seen many ghosts. And finally, next to him we have Hi, I'm Megan Caves and I'm playing I have to read my name because I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing It's a sign of a good name. Yeah. I like Twidget Bolt Walk at Terran. She goes by Gadget because non gnome people, I guess is how you would say that. Non gnomes no. don't like how many names gnomes have because each one of their family members gives them a name. Uh, so yeah, she goes by Gadget to make it easier for everybody else. And, uh, yeah, I've seen ghosts. I use them in all of my, my things. <laughs> ghosts in the machine? Yeah. Mm. Uh, what do you think that robot, how, how do you think that works? Oh, God. That robot had a ghost inside of it? Yeah, it wasn't a, a, a person from outside or a little kid or anything. It wasn't one of the ghosts from my past, was it? Uh, uh, no. Was it one of my congregants that was torn to shreds by wolves? I would never do that. All right. I just don't think they deserve that fate. You, you're right. They've suffered enough. But what if they wanted to work a little bit? Mm -hmm. They need a, they need to leave me alone. Just a happy, get over it. it was I tried my best. It was a ghost that was happy to bartend. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, so dream. that's what it was. That's true. A, uh, uh, a young boy who died before he could become a bartender. Exactly. Great. Uh, like I said, we are saving throw. We are an independent channel with no corporate backing, to, so to speak, and uh, we exist and grow based on the generous tips from you guys in chat. So if you'd like, you can uh, send us a tip and uh, as a side effect of tipping, we also have a whole list of unlocks that you can see if you type in exclamation point unlocks in chat. Um, and also you can send in cheers for us to cheers to. Um, I believe there are three gold cheers and then past that you can pay $15 to send in cheers. Um, and let's see, I think that's it for <gasps> Chi- Oh, oh my. Spooktacular. Thank oh you, BSB Care. Thank you, BSB Care, for that 15. Thank you for that tip. Appreciate it. Mr. Um, there are some fun things you guys can unlock in there, and tonight there's some really fun things, and these guys are gonna need all the help they can get. Uh, speaking of all the help you can get, what do you guys have so far at the table? Let's go around and do uh, your HP and any other things you have. Rerolls uh, re or candles or uh, any tarot cards, anything like that. Bully as 
What do you have? Uh, uh, I have 18 hit points. Okay. And I have one superiority die left over. Okay. So you spent a lot of it last time. Yep. Okay. Uh, Grizz? Um, I have 27 hit points. Um, I don't, tank. I did not get hit last time. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, I have one candle uh, and one reroll. Great. Were you, were you the one who was climbing the statue, or was that? Or no, was that, that was yeah. that was gadget. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, and the candles can be used uh, to uh, gain advantage on any roll. That's what they're for, and that I believe is the first uh, unlock on our uh, unlock list. Uh, gadget, what do you have left? I have my full twenty-four hit points. Mm -hmm. Great. Uh, and I have two rerolls, one candle, and one wizard card. Ooh. One wizard card, which can be used at the start of uh, any um, combat for a fun, random, exciting effect. Ooh. That could be bad. How could, could be could these wizards. How about you, Mirko? You got anything uh, left? Uh, Mirko. Night Steed, thank you for the 10. Thank you, Night Steed. $10 dollar donation, Night Steed. Uh, Mirko has nine hit points out of 24. Uh, due nine. to a uh, ill-fated wow. heroic charge against a much more powerful opponent. Yes, I believe you got crit by a zombie as you were trying to run away. Yeah! Well, you were running after Damien. Yes. Yeah. I was I was focused on the mission, unlike some of my companions. We're all real focused. Um, <laughs> Uh, so yes, uh, but he, but he but he took a chunk out of uh, Mirko's backside, um, and so he's down to nine, and he has no rerolls and no uh, advantage candles. Okay. He is just vanilla Mirko. Okay. That's all he needs. Well, uh, luckily the first tier was unlocked, which is inspired by the flame. So each one of you is awarded a candle of inspiration. Thank, Thank you. you. Pass that so down. Nice Thank, Thank you for care. unlocking that. Thank right? you. For unlocking Thank you so very much, much. chat. You guys all work together. Ooh, that's another oh, toast yeah, coming yeah, in. Get ready for all these. Cheers. Here's oh, another one. Pass that down. There you go. There you go. Okay. This one is nice. yours. Danke. Thank you for that, chat. Uh, okay, let's see what else I have on my list here. Uh, oh, you can also, if you, ha if you at home or at work, if you have Amazon Prime, uh, you can subscribe to free, for free, any channel any channel on Twitch. And if you want to choose us, that's cool. Just link your Twitch account to your Amazon Prime account, and you can do that for free. We would really appreciate it. Mm -hmm. um, so. There is also a world building doc that I put together. If you go to tinyurl.com slash alwayscloudyrpg, and it's also exclamation point Barovia in chat if you want to see that. And it tells you a little bit about uh, the setting that we're playing in and uh, about the cast of characters that are involved. And uh, let's see, I think that's it for this. Ooh, let's go through some of these. Let's go through some of these toasts. Uh, raise a glass, everybody. Oh my oh. god. We got okay. some cheers to do. Okay. Okay, here's the first one. BSB Care. Cheers. To historians trolling idiots on Twitter. To, to historians, historians trolling idiots on Twitter. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. 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 Mm. Delicious. What is that in reference to, I wonder? Well, well BSB Care is a historian. No, he's yeah. not shit, is he? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't yeah. realize American that was his, um, history, like, believe. legit historian. Legit. Uh, legit. Uh, here's another cheers. The Posh Panda cheers. Cheers to the ghost of the young boy gadget put in that robot outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Cheers to, to the ghost of the young boy gadget put, put in that, that robot outfit. outfit. Cheers. Yes. Real grim. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> He's happy in there. Uh, He's very he always happy. wanted to be oh, a always serving man. <laughs> we have one more. Uh oh. Almost as cool. Cheers. Uh, oh. Look oh. at me. I'm the toast man now. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Look at me. me. I'm, I'm the, the toast, toast man, man now. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you. Almost as cool. <laughs> yes. Yes. Almost as cool is the GM of our Wild Cards game on Friday nights, which is. Oh, I was making a joke about that. Oh. We could really? use his real name, right? Well, thanks for, oh. thanks no, for we watching cannot. Almost as Cool. We can never do that. Yeah, it was very nice of you to tune in. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Cool. Let's get this right. Okay. Ask him about that. Ask him about what? Do you know the, the history of that name? He almost came up with that uh, when we joined Saving Throw, so. Really? Anonymous, yeah. thank you for the 200 bits. Okay. That thank was probably you. a really funny name that we can't see <laughs> because Anonymous. it gets. Anonymous. Yeah. Gets uh, censored in yeah. Streamlabs. Feel free so. to shout Let's laugh out. at this name. Because we know it's funny. Right. Hee hee ha ha. <laughs> oh, Whoa, that's a good one. Oh, oh, didn't oh, see that coming. Oh, nice going. That was good. Wonderful. Yeah, that good was times. Good. Um, okay, let's move on. Uh, let's talk about what happened in the last episode yeah. of It's Always Cloudy. No? Dom doesn't want to? No. Okay. Ghost okay. hack, thank you very much. Ghost hack, hey, thank you for the hundo bits. Okay. Previously, in preparation oh. for the Festival of Devil's Fell, 
The gang all banded together and got crag holers ready for the influx of new visitors. One of those new faces was Palure Swanson, the troop leader of the performing carnival that was set up just outside of town. He recruited Firk to play the role of his ancestor, Reeve Cragholder, in a play retelling the story of how Strahd von Zerovic was slain. On the morning of the festival, Gadget woke to find Damien missing with a note that said he wanted to check out the festival. With what they knew about the child, they knew they had to find him quick, lest darker powers steal him away. They found him with a toy maker, Shuchuk Blitsky, and took him to watch the show. But when it was first time to shine, a member of the cast was brutally murdered and then reanimated on stage, and a horde of zombies and wolves were set free among the crowd. Fighting for the lives of their fellow townsfolk as well as themselves, they defeated the bloodthirsty mob, but lost track of Damien during the chaos. Mirko gave chase and found a stranger in a black cloak dragging him out of town. And after a brief confrontation, confrontation, the man fled with Damien on a phantom steed, and Mirko gave his raven familiar an order to follow him. Now, the fate of all of Barovia rests on this one child. If there's a way for Strahd to return and take his body as his own, it'll be a time of darkness and dread once more. Although in Barovia, darkness and dread are more common than not. Because it's always cloudy in Barovia. Okay, guys, welcome back. Hello. So, let's get started. You know, the thing I noticed is that the only, like, Mirko has a black cloak. Yes. And this oh. bad guy apparently had a black cloak. He's catching on here. He's oh, catching no. on. I've never seen this guy and Mirko together. And um, so. <laughs> speaking, saying I've been out into the woods? Speaking of Mirko, thank you, Bondo, for the hundred Thank you, Bondo. Thank bits. you, the bard. Anybody? Oh, yeah, and the bard, 1971. To get rid of Damien, it would probably be Gadget. Ooh. Mine's red. So. Right, so it can't be you. Right. Um, so speaking of Mirko, Mirko, yes. peering towards the horizon, <coughs> you see the village of Barovia in the distance, and you realize you're perched on one of the walls of Castle Ravenloft. Mm. Well, not you, but Bernie, your raven familiar. Ah! <laughs> it's very loud. <laughs> Using your connection with your familiar, you're able to see and hear through him as a vessel. Mm-hmm. Looking down into one of the crumbling holes on the roof, you see a figure in a dark cloak pacing a lit chamber. At the center of the room, chained to the floor, is Damien Taminsky. Your raven flies inside and finds a nice spot on the rafters to sit and listen. Mm -hmm. And it hears, Please, please, no, let me go. Please don't hurt me. Please, please. Shh, dear child. Do not worry, the dark figure says as he runs his hands through Damien's hair. This will only hurt in the beginning. As your body gets used to it, the pain will fade. You see him raise the darkened heartstone that he retrieved from the hag, mm. and a pool of black energy washes over Damien, causing him to seize and scream. After a moment, he lowers it and speaks again. Tell me, child, did you see that performance tonight? It's interesting how much history changes when it's written by arrogant fools with no respect. Lord Strahd was never that pompous, and he did not look down upon his servants. He cherished all his subjects and only wished them well. And that man in bandages, a wrapped up corpse, to play his most loyal of servants, Rahadin. Such poor taste. And then you see the figure reach up and lower the hood of his cloak, revealing an elf with dusky brown skin 
and long black hair. <laughs> the left side of his face has a, shifts uncomfortably. has a very <laughs> has a very large <laughs> scar that covers most of his eye and cheek. He smiles at Damien, grabbing his face by the cheeks and turning it towards himself, and he says, "Honestly, does it look like I need bandages?" And then he raises his heart stone again, and as he does, he spots you in the rafters. Watching from above. Ah, looks like we have a visitor. Can you make a wisdom saving throw for your raven? Yes. So they have a plus one to wisdom if you didn't have that written down. Oh, right wow, there. well, nice, nicely done. Uh, is a 19 good enough? It is good enough. Oh, damn right so it is, Bernie! You see a wisp of green energy erupt from the heart stone forming into a giant claw that extends towards the raven and tries to snatch it out of the air, but just misses. Ah! And at this point, I assume your raven's going to fly away. Yes. <coughs> okay. Because it's it a pain in the ass to resummon that raven. Ugh. And it does. It takes a whole day. It's so boring. <laughs> and now your vision returns. And you find yourself sitting in a chair at a table in Crag Holders with your comrades surrounding you. Me? Patiently waiting. Yes, oh. you. Well, how did I get back here? You were scrying from this room. Oh, was I? Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize. I thought I was still out in the woods. No, I assume you came back instead yeah. of waiting out in the woods. Yeah. Yes, that's true. Mirko. Mirko. <gasps> oh, he's back now. That's what he does. <sighs> did he stop breathing? Because he the just... boy. I mean, I think he'd like to. The boy is in serious danger. Oh. He's being held captive by an evil man. Very evil man. We need to go to him at once. Did you see where? Yes, he's in the castle. Brave Ravenloft? Castle Ravenloft. It is abandoned, but uh, we found there was a room there. And uh, the man there, whose name was, excuse me at the moment. It was Rahadin. Rahadin, that's what it was. I didn't write it down. Rahadin. Rahadin. He has returned. Like, and like, he is going to summon Strad and no. use the boy as his vessel. I, we need to go there at once. Yeah, that seems like a bad thing. We should probably go fix that. Absolutely. Sounds sounds like they need some crack holders. And uh, this is this is what we do. Us crack holders. Well, it was your ancestor who did it. <sighs> right? Uh, yeah. No, you got it. I'm just saying that he was trained to do that. He was certainly very brave. Yeah, that too. I don't know if there is the same amount of bravery in this inn right now. Yeah, it's been a hundred years. I mean, everybody's relaxed. I have I, my doubts. I was trained the same way as Reeve. <laughs> oh, well, that's good. Then, then you can do it. I just... Uh, Are I you up to the test? I to run the stupid bar, but I won't... Okay. The yes. hell with the bar! <gasps> what? There are more important things right now. Didn't I just call it a stupid bar? <laughs> well, you did. Leave the bar. I don't appreciate that. This bar the is, bar is holding down. you down. And this drum. No, I know that, but I'm... From your destiny as a hero. Okay, the bar is not stupid. <sighs> from, uh, from behind the bar, you see Bumble speak over as you start playing the drum. <laughs> see, this is, this is all I can do. This is... I can't no, fight. It's good because what you do with the, the, the drum and, and when you talk to people, it makes them feel better. You think so? It makes me feel better. Yeah. Okay. We don't um, have time for this you conversation for and forgive me for your drums. We need to leave now. The boy is in trouble. It will take a long time to get there. My apologies. He's never, um, he's never been so mean to me. I, I it is a most urgent situation. We cannot be sitting also, here. Also, it's not that far to Castle Ravenloft. Yeah, <laughs> well, you did not see what I saw, dwarf! <laughs> All right, we're calling people by their race now. Okay, what? human. He takes out a potion. Uh, you can call me goblin if you want. I don't mind. Zit sitting on the counter just wiggling his legs. Ooh, that's oh, wow, that's a pretty good roll. Nice. You're doing a healing potion? Yes. Great. Back up to 18. Nice. Okay, well, you know, like in armies, when they have the big drums happening, mm -hmm. maybe when we start to fight, I can do the morale drums. Oh, yes. And yeah. 
Right? Yes, perhaps oh, we yeah. play a nice jaunty marching tune while we are marching to Castle Ravenloft oh, yeah. to save this boy. That's a great idea. We go now. Yes. We go now. 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 What okay. about you, Goblin? What about what about me? What's happening now? Do you have bravery inside of you? Oh, oh. no, not at all. No, <laughs> absolutely not. No. Do you no. wish to see this boy <laughs> safe? I don't know who this boy is. No, absolutely not. Do you want to keep your job? I, I mean, I feel like I'm going to get it anyways. Do you wish for Strahd to return with his iron fist and squash all goblin kind? Well, I, I wasn't here when he was around. I don't know much about him, but oh, I mean, if he's... You don't know fear. I don't? You don't know fear. I mean, it's good, right? You don't want to know fear, because then when it comes, you're like... Oh, I don't care! You don't know fear either! No, I don't! <laughs> None of you do. Zit. You will know fear when Strahd has returned. Eh. We could also just leave Barovia. Right? We can get out now. That, no, not, we're oh, yeah. orders. We have to face this. No, no we're going to go save them. I mean, we're just waiting for you guys to get up and go. What? Well, we're waiting for I you mean, to get up. He keeps yelling at us to go, but he keeps talking and yelling. But Zit has to come. You have to come. What? <laughs> No, 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 no. Zit's not going anywhere. No, me but and Bumbles. Bumbles, is. Bumbles oh. come in. Bumbles and, Bumbles and me, we a pair. We ain't going anywhere. Haven't Bumbles. you ever heard the song about Strahd and the goblins? No, what? That's a song? The goblins it is a were song. goblin their dinner. Yeah, we and just Strahd that. came and gobbled the goblins for dinner. He yeah. eats goblins? Dinner rhymes with dinner. Who eats goblins? Name another <laughs> word that can rhyme with dinner, I dare you. Sinner? Okay, pretty good. That's actually, that pretty would have been pretty useful. That's myself, yeah, yes. that's, that's Winner, good. I See, guess. I need you. Maybe I should be a bard. <laughs> uh, no, 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 me and Bumbles, we're going to stay here. After all, who's going to take care of all the business? That this bar's going to get while you're gone, right? This goblin has no courage. Come, we must leave. Yep, he's on it. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, Mirko um, packs his stuff and he walks outside. But but I will. I'll, I'll raise a glass to you guys. Uh, Save your toasts, she says, throwing the door open. And well, okay, hand. but they, they want it. The dark spirits want a toast, so why don't you guys raise your... Ah, fine, I'll roll. Toast one more time. Okay, okay great. Um, Sometimes Bash alcohol and, can give you courage. Bash and Phil's toast. Peace. Mankind ill needs a savior such as you. Mankind ill needs a savior such as you. Cheers. Good bit. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Thank you, Bastion Phil's, for that toast. Um, Bastion Fees. Okay, yeah, good toast. Uh, I said it right. You guys can uh, just get on going and we'll just take care. And at this point, the front door opens and you see Serena Taminsky limp in using a crutch in her right arm to support herself. This is the mom, right? And mm -hmm. yes, this is the mother of Damien. <laughs> and speaking to a that. guard who's right behind her says, thank you, I'll, I'll be fine. Please just wait outside. And she walks in and kind of studies the room. This is like, where is Damien? Uh, he's upstairs. <clears throat> is he? No, he's not upstairs. Well, if you, if you tell them the truth, it kind of ruins my life. Some, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Walking upstairs would have ruined your lie, too, yeah. so... Well, I mean, I think we could have spun it out a little bit more. You gotta, you gotta start small. You can't you separate a mother to... from her child. Yes. Oh, we can this try. I mean, we did actually do that. We Serena, did. We, we did everything we could, and it was... But Mirko has found, has found him, and we're going to rescue him now. <clears throat> what, where is he? I'll come with you. He was kidnapped by an evil man. Rahad, uh, Rahadin. Rahadin. The mummy? <laughs> He's no mummy. He is a elf with oh. horrible facial scars. And he is currently right now at Castle Ravenloft, and we need to go Castle there Ravenloft? immediately. What's he doing at Castle Ravenloft? No, no, it's no not a place for children. <laughs> he does not mean to... <sighs> Let me put it this way. He intends... To do harm to Damien. I, uh, we did all we could. Uh, but we must rescue the boy now. We must go. If you would come with us, I suppose we cannot say no. But it is very dangerous. I... I would like to come with you, but... With my leg like this, I can only... Go so far, and... I yes. would only slow you down, and I... 
I'm sorry, I... I don't think I have... the power to keep myself alive at such a place. Please, please, it's fine. Don't worry, I give you my word. I will return... I give you my word. What was that last word? I will <laughs> return your boy, unharmed. You've been drinking a little bit, I see. I have been drinking! <laughs> you have not seen the horrors I've seen! It's I'm over. sorry, I don't... I snap like that, I go off... I understand the horrors. He was a raven for a couple hours today, so, you know. I see. It's a very difficult transition. No, it's, it's, I understand. It's truly, it's madness out there. There are small pockets of undead that are creeping out of the sewers and attacking random people. Once, Once that attack happened, something became loose in the village and the guards are taking care of it. There's not that many, but they're coming out of any hole they can find in the ground. And, and stay safe. We will sorry, return you, your boy. Are you all right, Gadget? Yeah. <laughs> are you laughing because I'm saying hole? No, Maybe. I was laughing at him. What did I say? And then it just kept going. <laughs> what? It sounds I'm not like perfect. I'm not laughing because she's laughing. I don't even know why we're laughing. I'm <laughs> sad. Sometimes I stumble over my words. Madness does strange things to people. I understand. You laugh. Yeah. You cry. It's. I laugh whenever I'm scared of a castle that we have to go to. I don't Sounds believe. I don't bad. believe it. I, I think oh. you're laughing at me. Well, I You are all I, laughing at Mirko. You, it's because oh. you were funny. Oh, Mirko, you have to return to the castle. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. I, I cannot come with you, but I can aid you. I can I can get some horses for you to get to the castle faster. Oh, that, that would help. That would you, you don't have to have any, like... Uh, uh, guards that could be spared, or, or even better, someone that can maybe do, like, you know, healing or something, because I don't know about you, uh, wizard, or, or you, uh, human, uh, but, uh, you know, I, I'm not in, in a he, great shape to be facing a dark him. lord right now. I, right no. I, I don't have anything on me, but... It's not easy, is it? <laughs> I think most of the supplies have gone to the guards, and they're taking care of the undead situation, and I cannot... I cannot send them to the castle. If they see my child, they will probably strike him down. Perhaps there is a merchant we can stop at on the way and get some healing potion. Well, Bullies... Bullies has been closed because of the... the horde, and... I, I will see what I can do, but... I can get you those horses, that's for sure. Give me just a moment, and I'll be right back. And she leaves out the door. Um, you guys were uh, waiting for him to come back, so you guys all get a small rest if you want to use oh, any yeah. uh, yeah, short rest. hit That's die. Right okay. So you can do that now. Okay. I also have, oh, hit die, right? I have yes. a song of rest. Okay. Um, I can use soothing music or oration to help revitalize your wounded allies during my wounded allies during Ooh, a. Hey. Thank you. Oh, Did thank you. you. Thank you. I said giants 49ers. Um, so, so you guys get an extra 1d6. This is during Ooh. a short rest? That's during a short rest. Oh, nice. We have an extra 1d6 of healing back? Yeah. Great. Yes, um, because I I have sung to you such soothing music as Grizz does. Yeah. <laughs> Get better! Ooh, ooh, you will get better! Ooh. What is this crap? Before you rolled a four on 3d6. <laughs> you sinners. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now you're using it! There it is! Well, okay. I get, I get a claim on that song, right? <laughs> I don't want to re-roll that. Oh, I can't re-roll it. Now. So, yeah, you can use your hit die, you have three, and roll them up, he'll Oh, wait, no, we get, but we get, sorry, I Plus a d6 added on. Plus a d6. So okay, hit die. so, unless I roll a one. Nice! Oh, nice, so you got a ten! Sweet! Fifteen. Here you go, as we turn to full health. Wow! Ooh. I'm just gonna use two, two of those. So. All healed up, Sorry. all ready to go? You're yes. already good? You're already Retoined. good? You're both at full? Yes, I was full. Mirko, what are you at now? Retoined. I'm back up to 24. 24, and you're back to full too? Mirko is at full Here's power. The oh, this is the extra. I'm almost to full. Almost to full, okay, cool. Um, so Serena returns and has four horses ready to go outside your door. Four white horses? I did not specify the color of the horses, so... Is that Mira? Nice, it's fine. Yeah. Okay. There is white a single horses. one of them is white, I suppose. Very attractive. Uh, They're handsome horses. What's happening here? Not we like that. Let's go. He's I have a connoisseur to... of horses. I am. Right. Clearly. I, I, I love the back. horses. Uh, yeah. There was a story he read on a scroll once about these four white horses. It was that's the end of, of the scroll and yes. it was how the Scroll kind of wrapped up the story. Was writing. On it was a yeah. very. It was a scroll, and it was turned into a book, y- which the, was then turned into a play that I thought was fantastic. It's in the history of Barovia that I have. It, it happened here. 
Well, once you return... Yes. It's about a princess. Once you return me... Barovia. Me and okay. Damien would love to hear that story. <laughs> I would love to tell you that story. <laughs> what? what name was what? <laughs> All I can think of was George. The princess was named George? Yeah. Okay, nothing wrong with that. Princess well, named George. Princesses could be named George. Yeah. Uh, Barovia. Georgina. No, it's George. It's George. Yes, but it was Princess Buttercup. Um, I remember specifically. So are you guys taking the horses and riding out? Yeah. Skip to the end. <laughs> oh, okay. No. Uh, you're, <laughs> you're all dead. No! What have I done? <laughs> okay. So you guys... You guys all head out on horses west of the village, taking the road... And you travel through Svalich Woods, past the glimmering Sear Pool, turning east when you hit the imposing gates of Barovia. And there, you travel through the valley and end up the mountainside until you see... Castle Ravenloft, up ahead. I thought those gates were imposing, but this castle is quite scary. It's far more imposing than even those imposing gates. Absolutely. Yes. You guys have heard many stories of Castle Ravenloft in your time spent in Barovia, and, well, just looking at it, you think you'd be a little more in your head about what you're about to go up against, but the castle just hasn't done well in the past mm -hmm. century when no one's taking care of it. You can actually see that the, the north and south side of it are actually crumbled. The rooms have just collapsed on themselves. Um, it's only a model. It, you think it is. And then you get closer and you're like, oh, this is a real castle. Oh. <laughs> uh, you cross over a wooden bridge and pass two tall gatehouses and find yourselves in a large open courtyard covered in mist and graves. Get this aside. <laughs> Oh my god! I'm sorry. But, 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 blue underneath. I'm sorry. What was the noises you just made? Oh look at it! That's we toying to the castle, George. Yeah. I'm doing everyone's thing that's making us laugh. Great. Thanks for that. Was it not blue? Ooh, it ain't that pretty. So you guys can put yourselves uh, around here. This is the entrance oh. of the courtyard. Yes. Uh, the minis are over there. Or did you already take them all? Yeah. Oh, you did. All right. Just put me off. closer to the back. Nice. Oh, perfect. Just drunk. Like We're all that? drunk. Perfect. But he said to talk. Nice. Yeah. Allow oh, me to close We landed this. up. Uh, not me. I am dwarf. I am oh, no, dwarf. Yes. He says his name. Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah. Look, yeah. you're staggered. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I'm not making fun of you, by the way. I just, <laughs> I'm just saying. It's yeah, it's great. That's, I mean, in uh, no one say hi like that. We all just say yeah. Oh, so I just think you're saying hi. <clears throat> um, Ferk, <laughs> as yeah. uh, as you're walking down the road towards uh, the castle, you look up into the sky, and for what feels like the very first time since coming to Borough, you see the full moon shining off in the distance. But something feels different about it. Something feels almost tangible about it. And it feels like you could just reach out and grab it. And as you make that motion, you bring down your hand and open it, and in the center of it, you see two haunted Barovian coins. Well, that was weird. Ooh, Everyone, look at that. everyone, reach um, for the moon. Aren't you lucky? The Dark Powers Black Dragon 8K no, give back. you a reroll. I and Joel Cost gives you a reroll. Thank you guys. Thanks Thank you so much. so much, Chad. Nothing happened. Grav, um, Try it again. While we are out of combat, I'm going to cast the spell Mage Armor. Got it. Done. Um, while you're doing that, mm -hmm. Mirko, you something has been bothering you ever since you got on that horse, and now that you get back on your feet, you realize there's definitely something in your boot. Ah. So you sit down for a moment, just double, hold on a second, and you shake out your boot, and out of all the like a small rock falls out and a scorpion. Ah, and then also a, a haunted Barovian coin. Oh, who do I have to thank for this? You can thank some red shirt. Some oh. red shirt! Gives a reroll to Uncle Mirko. Thank you. You I like. <laughs> you I like. Uh, thank you, chat, for those. Some red shirt. I'm writing your name down. Oh. You, I, oh. I will sing paeons to your beauty. Paeons? Paeons. Retwain? Pay on or paean? Paean. I think it's paean. I don't know. P-E-O-N... What are you going to say, Gadget? P-A-R. So we... 
where are we exactly? Like, are we going through like a court? Wait, this is a graveyard. It's a courtyard that is also a graveyard. So the castle is this way. <laughs> yes, the castle is up ahead. We might. You guys might let me go first, so I can scout it out and see if there are any traps. Great. Yeah. Sounds okay. good to me. Please be careful. I always am. How far ahead would you like to soak up any of the damage of any trap? Like, goes okay, off. I can hear you saying that. I'm really good with traps. No I'm just looking into it's any it's wells. A truth. Like that's that's a good point. <laughs> uh, I have been down these a bit. We'll go like maybe yeah. ten feet or whatever. Five. Uh, yeah, ten feet in front of everybody. I suppose. Oh, just ten feet. Okay, not very far. And you guys start marching in that order, forward. Now that uh, I don't hang yeah, back by the gates. Drum, okay. So. You're going to like, hang back by the now gates? Now that we're here, yes. I don't really want okay. to play the Until drums. I know it's safe. Oh, well, you'll, you'll know when to play him. Like, I think you get a, be... you'll, you'll get a feeling inside where you're like, I can't play. <clears throat> if I if I don't play, it's not going to happen. Like, I, it, it's a music inside of me that has to come out. I, I was just saying, I think we should be stealthy. Why? It, I mean, there's nothing to fear here. No, just, right? just a great evil. Uh, well, boy. not yet, because he has to possess the boy, right? I that hasn't happened yet. I think evil can exist even if they don't possess the boy. Nah. Uh, as she's, because I assume there are some fallen gravestones and things, she's kind of like, she goes over here and hides behind one, okay. and peeks around, and then goes over there and hides <laughs> behind one. Takes okay. cover. Yeah. Um, and also searching for. Are you still for staying it. by the gate? Right here? Bounding the watch. Um, yes. Okay. Um, let's say when you get to about here, you hear an eerie sound off to the side. You look over and you hear some moaning coming out of the ground. And you see two oh. hazy glowing figures rise out of a coffin Sorry. that has been left on the side of the road. And they say, give it to me. You don't deserve your life. And uh, let's get this party started. Roll initiative, everybody. Okay. Whoa! See, Burke, ghosts do exist. <sighs> I don't know that that's a ghost, but okay. Oh, sorry, we were rolling initiative. Oh, we know it's... Oh, yes. I did not roll yeah. very well. I got to seven. I also got to seven. That's the I... tiniest dice I've ever seen. Uh, they glow in the dark. Oh, you got the mini dice. I'll show you. Uh, um, before you roll any initiative for you, you have a card. Did you want to use that card oh, now yeah. or, or save it? No, I want to use it. Okay, and then also, you still have the magic pocket watch, which you got in the first episode. Thank you, Vampire 54. Vampire 54, thank you for the 20. Thank you. Thank you. Vampire 54. So for the people that weren't here, and for a, a refresher for you guys, she got a magical pocket watch in the first episode that lets her freeze time out of combat for 30 seconds or use it at the start of combat to rearrange all of the initiative however she seems, whatever she yes. wants to do initiative-wise. That's Ooh. very true. So whatever you want to do, you can save it for later or you can use it now for the wizard card mm. and that. Up to you. No, um, hmm, hmm, well, should I, s hmm, should I save one for later? Like when we're fighting something that might be big? Yes, this is going to be an easy, Okay, which one should combat. I Yeah, my, my axes can cut through ghosts, no problem. <laughs> then I'll save both of them. You're gonna save both of them? Great. Yeah. Okay, uh, all right, tell me your initiative then. I'm gonna roll for these guys. I got a 10. Okay. I rolled an 8. Seven. The gadget. We all oh no. Oh no. How are you gonna get you that? You lost it. Oh, you can just reach behind. It's gone forever. What'd you get? 7. Oh. Okay. Oh, we are all you also got a 7? Yeah. Very Who's got slow. A higher dex? I Who's got, got the highest one. Uh, the my dex yeah, it's equals, all relative. Uh, e equals. Uh, no, he has higher dex. Okay, yeah. then Firk is first, and you are last. <clears throat> uh, let's hope that these guys don't goof their don't, rolls. Don't, don't stress oh, okay. Don't be a goof, Ew. guys, come on. Come on. Oh, okay, that's a goof. Great job. Wow! wow. That's a three and a one. Wow. So somehow... Somehow. Oh, uh, wait, I have, I have nine re-rolls back here. I'm gonna spend one on at least one of these. Wow. I mean, I could save it for when they're attacking you, but, but you I guess... you can't re-roll the one. You're right. What? I'll do ah. three. You're right. You're right. I can't reroll the one. It's a roll from Barovia. Okay, one of them does go first, though. Monster number one. Okay. Monster number two. So. Ah, I ah, called him ah. M1 and M2. Very good. I like the way you mind works. So that first uh, <laughs> specter approaches you, Gadget. Wow. And it reaches out a spectral hand. Mm. 
And let's see. Level drain. No. <laughs> Level drain. What is that? Is that from second edition? Yeah. Level drain. Level drain was the word. This attack, this attack does have drain in the, in the title. Yeah. Oh, that's a two. Mm, that's terrible. I'm gonna reroll that. Because I have so many. That's a sixteen. Sixteen plus four twenty. Uh, I mean, yeah. Cool. Twelve. The same as Ava. So you take twelve necrotic damage. <laughs> Booms! And then also, give me a DC ten Constitution saving throw. Oh my God! And you are gonna want to pass this. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. Don't be afraid to use your rerolls. I use. Oh yeah, this. there you go. That's a good one. You just hand me the candle. Oh, That's I'm it. sorry. I, I, I'm trying to save my own life. <laughs> like it's a birthday cake. It's so cinematic. <laughs> Make a wish. Uh, okay. She's gonna gift that, you guys. You know she is. <laughs> it's like no. it doesn't need me to. Yeah. Tote, totes getting gift. Uh, Megan dreams in gifts. I, you know what? I'll be out in the real world and, and somebody does something. I'm like, oh, that, nope, no, I can't gift that. <laughs> nope, nope, can't gift that. Yeah. Uh, I got an 18. 18 is a success. Huzzah! Uh, so you just take the 12 points of necrotic. Okay. okay, it is your turn next, Gadget. And well. uh, real quick, chat did unlock tier two, Ooh. titled Final Dining. Uh, so I will, uh, we'll get to that when we get to it. But thank you for we'll unlocking that chat. We are, I believe, 25 away from the next tier. Um, okay. So 25 people with $1 each. Yeah, or 50 people with 50 cents each. <laughs> if everybody in chat could just donate $1, to you save, could change a person's life. Save the Mirko. <laughs> you could save Mirko from his destruction. Or Gadget at this point, because Gadget just got yeah. Yeah, 12. Was that, 12. Did you roll high amount of damage, or maybe, I don't know. Uh, they rolled 3d6 on damage. Oh, Ooh. that was half my hit points. All right. Um, <clears throat> this thing is, I mean, what does it look like? It looks that? like that. It looks exactly like that. Like a puffy marshmallow. That it is an like official, space princess. that's an official Spectre <laughs> mini. Really? Yeah. Mm. Wizards. I um, don't know. That spectres I have. look like lumpy space princesses. They do. Like do the today. the picture makes more sense, but if you look at it, there's like a ghost coming out of a cloud. Oh. But like, yeah, it's it's a weird looking mini. Oh, I see it now. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. Cool. It just looks like a, a they don't like you. marshmallow. Yeah. A cooked a, cook, a cook purple marshmallow. Oh, I hear that. What? Oh. Sauron? <laughs> Sauron. He's kind of waiting. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm waiting for my turn now. Yeah, I don't know uh, 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 if there's uh, uh, anything I can do the, to this guy. I mean, I can knife. stab him with my rapier, but what what do I stab? I mean, it. Mm -hmm. Does it that work? It'll do something. Okay. It won't do much, but it'll do something. You can disrupt its energy or something like that. <laughs> you could what? Disrupt oh. its en energy. Yeah. So I, I just stab it. Okay. Make an uh, attack roll. That is a nine. Nine is not enough. Yeah. Maybe I'll reroll it. Oh, all right. Using a haunted Barovian coin. Okay. I mean, that's a 12. A 12 hits? <gasps> Yay! It works! A 12 is what you need to hit them. That is the DC of their armor class. My God, this me. <gasps> Are you a specter? Wait, so she could have hit you? Eight. Eight points. Okay, uh, you, you thrust your second. rapier inside, and in your as head. expected, it does not do much, but it does do something. They do, uh, uh, they sort of spread away from uh, your the point of your blade and then reform. So you I think I pissed it off. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Next up, anything else? Any bonus actions you'd like to do? Uh, yeah, I might. Can I? I can. You can I disengage as a bonus. Right? That's what yeah, you're I'm gonna, gonna do. disengage. And then you can move uh, uh, 25. Uh, I believe. Run. Um, can I? I want to get behind, like hide behind something. Sure. Like, could I come over here, basically? Absolutely, you can get there. That. Okay. Yeah. Great. Okay. Mirko. Mirko. Mirko Bolgash, it is your turn. Stand at the fence line. Weaves magic incantations. Oh, rigas! And shoots a firebolt at this gentleman here. Maybe this ghostly can. specter. Gentleman. Firebolt. Firebolt. Bring it, brah. Fireball would be awesome. Hey, look at that, a 19. A 19 hits, you just needed a 12. <laughs> I will burn you, ghost man. Seven points of damage, baby. Seven is a wow. solid hit. It Woo! and does not like it. <laughs> uh, I fear not the ghosts. Would you like to move or do anything else? No, I will stay put. Okay, next up is Ferk. 
I'm no frontline fighter. Uh, Berk will, um, Please do uh-huh. me. turn to the one next to him <coughs> and, uh, and, s- s- like, in one quick motion, just grabs the, the butt of his axe and <laughs> it unha- un- unattaches from the holder on his back and he'll fling it up and around and then so just cool. swip, uh, swipe it across. Let's this, see what they think about that. I don't think that they... I'm not. I'm not a funny, because you look like Lumpy Space Princess. I'm not <laughs> They do! Is Lumpy Space Princess the Princess of Barovia? Yeah. 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 George. Lumpy Barovian Princess? George. <laughs> George is a <our> good friend. <laughs> that's, a, that's a 21. Yeah, that's a, that's a hit. It's cool. a big old hit. <clears throat> cool. roll, some, roll some damage. Dang it! That's five. Uh-oh. Five. Five slashing damage. Uh, so reduced by half, that is only two. I don't like you. Um, I like you. Oh, thank you. Give me your soul. Anything else? Would you like to? Uh, uh, you moved to here. Yeah. Um, no. Uh, can I take another attack if I don't move? Is that a thing? I don't think so. No. no. Oh, like, are like you just, a full attack? Are you just bargaining with me? Yeah. Well, there, there is, isn't there a full attack? Like, but, but that's only if you have... I think so. It might be a feat or only something. Only if you have multiple attacks. Can only, you if I was, attack? only if I was wielding... If I was, or, yeah, if if I was doing two weapons. If I was doing wielding, right. but I think I'm you not. would get uh, two attacks. I'm not, I'll even though you, I am a two-weapon I'll fighter. trade you 10 HP for an extra attack. Oh, easy, yeah. <laughs> Good. Bonus, bonus, dude. Anything else for me, then? Bro? No. Uh, no. Gris. Um... I'm going to uh, kind of run. I'm going to like run back behind this little uh, gravestone here and kind of here. Uh, no, on the other side, oh. like that little, and just like kind of hide. And I'm gonna like pop. That's all hiding. I'm gonna pop my head up <laughs> and say, and say, you'll never be alive again, you little ball of fluff. <laughs> and vicious mockery. Oh. So you Man. have to succeed on a wisdom oh, saving throw. That one hurt Mirko. We will live again when we take your corpse. Um, that is true. That's uh, how you that have works. to do a wisdom saving throw. These guys oh. are really rude. Oh. Wisdom saving throw? Well, the 12, which your thing um, is. I think mine's 13. It is 12 on here unless it changed. Uh, my. It, it should be on your on your spell sheet, at the top of your spell sheet. It's your, your save spells. DC. Yeah, save oh, DC. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's 12. Oops. So does that mean you get it? Yes, because I, I met it. I believe that's how that works for saving throws. I see, I see, I see. I can't re-roll that, can I? I mean, <laughs> well, he, I know. you can't make him re-roll <laughs> that, I don't think. Oh, no, yeah. Did I get that rule? So What's nothing on a, on a successful save? Okay. They are not uh, slowed by your words. Anything else? I don't think I can. Okay, this one is gonna go and attack the closest target, which is Fierk. 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 Fierk, get out of there. Ooh, I got a 19 plus four. Ugh, miss. Sure. Well, I mean, sure. I mean, hit, I mean, hit. <laughs> BSB Care, thank you for the 10. Thank you, BSB Care. Uh, you take seven necrotic damage. I and uh, make a DC 10 constitution saving throw. Uh, yeah, it's an 11. Eleven, you succeed. Wow. You feel some life nice. drain out of you, but you are... How much? Was that seven? Seven, yes. You feel some life drain out of you, but uh, it'll probably come back eventually. It's not gone forever. Uh, Gadget, it's back to you. Oh, sorry, my ear fell off. Oh, no! Oh, God! Oh, God! You take, <laughs> you take, four, right? you okay. take four points of damage right. for that. <laughs> I mean, I rolled it, so... Um. Okay, uh, okay, I'm over here now. Um, I want to set my, uh, my rapier down. Mm, draw my short bow. So if I just drop my rapier, can I? You can switch shoot? weapons, yeah, that's fine. I can switch, okay. Yeah, you I will do that and shoot at that guy. Great. Uh, Must be thinking of Pathfinder. Right. Whatever. Uh, I still got a 12, I got a 12. A 12 is it? Yeah. Roll some damage. 
You aimed at this one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> baby! Eight. Eight piercing damage. Eight piercing damage. <laughs> That's uh, you. Thank you. Are you sure you didn't aim at this one? I mean, can I reach that one from here? Where's my range? With well, a short bow? Yeah. yeah. You don't have to I can name it that one. I was Both just going to say, because then you get a sneak attack bonus. Oh, on that one? Yeah, because someone's engaged with Oh, yeah. Nice. Uh, which gives me an extra d6, right? 2d6, I believe. Should say up here. An extra 1d6 damage. Oh, it's 1d6? Oh, okay. I thought it changed Maybe to 2. 2 yet. I'm pretty so sure it's 2. Three more. At level 3. For what? sneak attack. I need to look it up real quick. Sneak attack! Not here. Well, it does say 2d6 up, up, oh, up here. here. You have a game. Yeah, if it says 2d6 up there, that's uh, where it is. Uh, well, that's 12. 12 total up after everything? Yeah. Okay. And that was on this one you changed it to. Yes. Okay. You see the arrow pierce its spectral skin and pass it right on through, but it does take the damage. Yeah, it should be 2d6 at their level. 2d6, great. It That's what I thought. That, it says it up here, but in the description it says one. Well, I goofed and I didn't change it. That's that. confusing. But I'm glad I remembered it. Thank you no, for looking at that. Don't, don't blame yourself. Blame uh, the good folks at Wizards of the Coast. Let's blame them. I like that. Yeah. yeah. Do better. Do a better job. Uh, do a better job. Mirko. Yes. Your turn. Ah, Mirko. Unless you wanted to move or anything. No, I'm Great. good where I am. All right. <laughs> Once again, um, Mirko takes out his wand, swishes it back and forth, flames erupt from the tip of the wand, and he points it at this guy and goes, Burn, ghost man! And shoots another firebolt. Fireball, fireball. If it's a 15. Uh, 15 is a hit. Whee! Roll some damage. All right. And that was against the this one? Or uh, this one here. Great. This one takes five more points of damage. <gasps> Boom! <gasps> Ra! Boom! I was watching Dota uh, <laughs> today at work. That's why I'm doing my Skyrath Mage for oh. this. I don't know. He's kind of good. The Skyrath Mage actually has a uh, Romania accent. I'm, not, oh. I'm not aware of that character. I need to look that up. Oh, he was so fun. That was uh, one of my favorites, favorite supports. I should play some more Dota. We should play some Dota. Let's do Bro, it. Let's get good at Dota I in got, June. I got no job next oh, Let's do it. Quirky Dota. Quirky Dota. QuirkyDota.com. Uh, okay, okay. okay. So, sorry. So, <laughs> this thing is on its last legs. Uh, <laughs> did you want to move or anything? Uh, no, no. Mir Mirko is Fear content to here. Yes, it's your turn. I was at harm's oh. way. <laughs> Oh, I see you do half damage to if I swing my axe at you. Oh, oh, look at me. I'm a lumpy space princess. Um, very rude. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> the metagaming is rude. Kill them. <laughs> you upset them. Yes. Oh, good. I don't. Okay, that's fine. Um. Uh, you want to go? Proud. You want to? You want You want a piece of me? Talk too much. <laughs> Let him monologue. Right? Then you can kill him. It's a fifteen. A fifteen hits. Let him monologue. Ooh. Uh, that's uh ten. Ten divided by Ooh. two is five. Yeah. You do five points of slashing damage. Well done. Well done. It is still standing or floating, I guess, at this point. Mm -hmm. Anything else from you? Do you like to move? <clears throat> Just walk away. Just walk home We're doing to your a good bar. job of splitting our damage, aren't we? Uh, yeah, a little mm. bit. <laughs> well, that one was right next to me. I would have taken <laughs> I know. Uh, no, I'm going to hold him here. OK, Grizz. Um, I'm going to pop up from behind the tombstone, and I'm going I'm to take out my sling, and I'm going to aim it for the one next to Ferk. As you pop up uh, from your uh, gravestone, uh, Something else pops up from the other side. Oh. And it's a small child that says, Boo! Ah! And then goes back <laughs> and then disappears. <laughs> That's so weird. What was that? Damien? Da Did not look like Damien. Did you. Uh, what was that? Oh, <laughs> you were saying? Head in the game, head in the game! Uh, can I. <laughs> walk around it? What? Like, well, it's not there anymore. It oh, just it's, went it's boo and then went away. I mean, you could turn, you could look, but... No, I'm just gonna take my sling and I'm Treat gonna... I'm gonna just aim it. Get Not away too... from my cousin brother! Okay. This one? Great, go mm -hmm. for it. Cousin An brother? actual slingshot. Uh, 16. 16 hits. Damn! And... 
Damn! Ooh, that's oh, that's maximum five damage. Bludgeoning. Whoa. Five bludgeoning. And that is to that Mirko one. Mirko is impressed. This one is looking pretty <laughs> neat as well. Gosh. Uh, so that stone, I assume it's a stone that comes out of your sling. What is slings? Right? Yeah. Stones? Yeah. So a stone uh, passes through the spectral form and it, it looks at you very angry, but then it focuses back on uh, Firk. Did you want to move or anything? Firk? No. Firk. Firk. Fark? Firk. Fark. Fark Cargo. Fark Fark Cargo. Fark 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 Bring it, Toki McTalkerson! <laughs> what? Uh, this is only 13. That's a miss on you. That's a big miss. I'm gonna uh, reroll. Okay. Right. Fine, waste your rerolls, dude. That is another nine. Well, that's a miss and a miss. Woohoo! You live to see another day. Uh, it is the other one's turn, which is over here. I guess this one should move to the closest target is you. Aww. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Oh yeah, if you just wave fast enough, oh, yeah, it's a big hit. Get to wave from her. Oh yeah. Twelve? Oh yes! Wait, no, just that still hits. Hit. Oh, oh, damn it. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm wow. sorry. If only I had a 13. Uh, you only take five points of necrotic damage. Oh, well, oh, wow. Just half it. But make a save. But make a save. Thank you, Mirko. Always yes. looking out for the bad guys. Teacher, do we have homework? <laughs> you will. Con save? Constitution. You forgot to give us homework, teacher. <gasps> uh -oh. That's a two. I'm gonna reroll. Ooh, with a haunted Barovian coin. Right. What, what was two? Wasn't something. Hey, that makes it. I got a nine. <laughs> oh, nine. My con is one. A nine is a failure. Uh, um, so you feel some of your life being sucked yes. out, and you okay, feel. I didn't need that. You feel almost thinner after this damage is done. Uh, your max hit points are reduced by that much. By five? Yes. Hey, yes. Oh, my. Uh, Gadget, it is now your turn. Now. Um, I don't feel very good. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick up my rapier and stab it. We're, we're still here. It's okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Come on, it's Mirko, sit me. down. Oh, sorry. Oh, what? Oh. Am I blocking the camera? I got a 10. For an attack, that is a miss. I don't feel very good. That's uh, it. It's stop. a big old miss. Stand stiller. Or still. Oh. Stand stiller. You're, stop moving. I'm trying to stab you. It was good. Thank you. Anything else from you? Uh, yeah, I'm going to move away from that good. thing. Okay. okay. Uh, I'll disengage. Disengage. Great. To... <laughs> you move five squares. You better not be doing that Oops Tyler commands. Over, I'll go right here. Great, perfect. I better not be seen that in chat. Uh, it was an honest mistake. Mirko. Ah. Oops, Mirko, you're done. Oops, Mirko. <laughs> All right. Guess what? I got more where that came from. Ah, firebolt! Of course, I'm right here. How are you going to find me? He's not no I'm hiding. not exactly hiding. No, he just said it like, right I here. I kind of think that they're not looking at us. Like, <laughs> like we just looking. want to talk. <laughs> We're just very lonely. The same one that I've been dinking. <gasps> oh, shh. What? Is that a miss? Yeah. I mean. I can't tell what that is. Is that a four? What's, no, that? it's a three. Oh, that's oh. probably a miss. Which is, I thought it was a one. There he's low, but not that low. Why did you start using the steel? The, the copper was working just fine. That's true, that's true. Because different dice roll different numbers. Don't fire bolts roll different? I mean... Huh? For, don't you roll for each bolt? Uh, I do. Oh no, that's bolts. a different one. That's a yeah. different text. You're thinking of Scorching Ray. That is correct. Uh, Anything else uh, for you? Uh, 54 oh. Aqua Snakes. 54, oh, so aqua, 54 snakes. aqua Snakes. <laughs> Terrifying. Well, uh, they start raining from the sky. I'm snakes. Not, I'm snakes. Gonna... Vampire 54 Aqua Snakes. Whoa. Whoa. Voltron. Whoa. 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 I'm just going to take the miss because failure is an important part. What did you learn? Uh, I learned that Mirko is infallible. Uh, Great. Fallible. Wow. Whoops. Freudian, Freudian slip. slip. Inspiration uh, point. Yeah. He gets no. inspiration for yeah. failing. No. Yeah. Tyler gets inspiration. Your turn. Here's an inspiration chip, Tyler. Nicely done. Uh, great role skill. playing, Tyler. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so uh, uh, he, he's just going to, again, just spin around and then take another another swipe at it. Go for right, it. Let's do it again. Ooh, that's not oh, good. Oh, no. That's not good. Are you 
That's a uh, three. Yeah, I'm going to re-roll it because I. Thank you for this haunted Barovian coin. No yeah. way that comes back to bite you in the butt. No. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's a team. Nice baby. Hey, yo. That's what you need. Whoa! Oh, right down on. the stairs. That's a count. <laughs> Uh, it's an eight. An eight is enough to end this thing's second life. Nicely done, baby. Second life? Oh, because oh. it goes It was oh. dead and that is like Well, what's living. it gonna do now? And it vanishes, I don't know, probably work at the supermarket or something. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can work at a bar. Like, oh. maybe. It, oh, perfect. Give him business card. Wait, come back. <laughs> got a soul gem. Maybe if you stop Good talking knowledge. and actually, you know, try to hurt me, it might have gone better for you, but it uh, didn't. It, it's double dead, so it can't hear you. It's double dead. Double dead. Double. You should have said that before you attacked. Yeah. You could take learn something from them. They talked before they died. You can say it to the other one. Oh. Wait, let him finish. Oh, I oh, all of us? that. Oh, okay. Together. We're all Simultaneously. Going today. I mean, we will. Uh, Grizz, okay. your turn. Wait. Oh, you want to move? Yeah, I'm moving towards that thing. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Mm. You get this far. Um. Very nice. Oh. And that was two, so this one is dead. Five. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm a little far from it. How does it deal with the fire damage? It does a decent amount. Much more than physical. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to sling it again. Uh, first. Sling it. Ooh, haunted Barovian coin. Let me see what you want. Two. Let's spend all these now. Oh, there it is. Um. <laughs> oh yeah, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like. What does he say? <laughs> what? Nothing. I would just. Oh. That's a one. Tie. Two bludgeoning. Two bludgeoning. Divided in half. Pew. <laughs> <laughs> Worth it. Yeah. Worth it. And he's out. Um, you and just kind of spook it. You and spook I'm gonna. Ghost. I'm gonna go. Enough. Straight towards it. Oh, okay. As close as I can. Wow. You hmm. can be right here if you'd like. Oh, wait, really? Oh. <laughs> if you want to be. Oh, oh I thought I could. Oh, I would have moved first then. I thought it was only. Oh. I, d I didn't think I could get that close. Well, you can. Oh, you have a magic sword. I do. You do. That would do I know, damage. but I didn't think I could get, um, I didn't think I could get that close. Well, what's done is done. Okay. Do you want to be here no, anyway? No, no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to okay. be able to. Uh, 5, 10, 15, Oh, yeah, you're right. I should have. I messed up. Yeah, I'll put me next to Ferk. Don't beat yourself up. Right here? We all make In front mistakes. of Ferk or next to Ferk? Next to Ferk. Great. <laughs> I don't want uh, to be closest. <laughs> uh, it is this thing's turn, and it is equidistant to both of you, so it is going to... Uh, odds evens? Evens. Oof. Good. So... No, Ferk! 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 Ferk can take a hit. Oof, that's yeah. a three. Let's You're going to miss two, punk. Uh, that mm. will probably be a 16, which is your armor class. Is it? Oh no, you boosted my armor class, guys, right? Mm. <laughs> How did I do that? You and I have the same armor class? 16? That's so weird. Oof. Is your, like, dex super high or something? Yeah. yeah. You take 12. Yeah, very quick. 12 necrotic. 12. And then make a con saving throw. 12. That's messed That's up. That's a 19 You're good. plus You're not, 3. It's not reduced by 12, yeah. so you just take 12. Gadget, back to you. Oh, uh, I'm gonna shoot at it. Can I shoot? Oh, it's like kind of in my way. Huh? You can shoot at it. Yeah, okay. they're yeah. engaged, damage. so it's a sneak attack. Yeah, okay. sneak, sneak attack. I'll shoot at it. I'm gonna use this little Stay tiny dice. Oh god, it's so Stay tiny. Stuck. What does that even say? It's so tiny. Is that I know, a one? those dice are ridiculous. Don't lie to me, is that a one? <laughs> no, it's not. It's a 14. That's plus a hit. Four, so 18. Yes, you hit it. Okay, and then. Oh, I'm on the This is with a short poke, right? Yes. So I get sneak attack, right? There's a different way. Yes, you do. So okay. your regular damage plus 2d6. Cool. Mm -hmm. Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10, ten is ten enough to bring damage. this uh, uh, uh. down. This is the end of this one's second life as well. Nice. Oh, nice. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Lemon squeezy. And the courtyard returns to its very quiet state. See? See? Nice. Nothing to worry about. You guys ah. gain 100 experience points. Yeah. Boom! Level up, baby! Um, do, do, do. Let's celebrate your victory with a toast. Oh, okay. How Please. about that? Oh! Vampire 54 toast to dinner! To, to dinner. dinner! I do like food. Yeah. 
I like dinner specifically. Mm. Yeah, we love mm. me some food. Mm. I really like lunch, but I, I also like breakfast really like for dinner. dinner. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, breakfast for dinner is good. I don't like breakfast at breakfast very much. Gadget, being someone who loves trinkets and items of value, do you go to inspect the corpse of one of these? Oh yeah, there's a corpse, yeah. Uh, you do find what looks like ghostly ashes, and sitting in the pile is a haunted Barovian coin. Just for you. Look what I found! I didn't uh, find it in the sky, it was on the ground this as time. As you reach out to grab it and pull it out, a snake, <gasps> a blue snake, slithers out <laughs> and down the graveyard. This was given to you by... You not 54 of them? 54 aqua snakes. Just one of them. Just one of them. Oh, Thank thank you. It was 54 yeah, inches a lot long. Of snakes. Oh. It was I, a very long... Did you guys see that snake? I'm pretty sure it was 54 inches long. <laughs> How do you know, That's like, lengths that accurately? <laughs> yeah. um, I mean, I'm really good at what I do. Ferk and Grizz, give me perception checks. Thirteen. Uh, nine. So, Ferk, from that distance, at the end of the courtyard, you see what looks like a dim light at the front door. Hmm. Okay. Uh, well, it looks like they are expecting us. Maybe a lit torch or something. Perhaps. Uh, so should we not be stealthy? Or be stealthier? Well, I think after this, I think we've pretty much lost our stealth ability. Yes, they know that we are here. They should are we, afraid. Should we just oh, march it As them. they should be. Thanks for the bits. Thank you Thank for you. the bitties. Uh, I mean, we could take the back door. Oh, that's a good point, too. Do you hear that? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, maybe there's still a piano in here. Or an organ? Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. There was an organ. A great, massive organ that Strahd would play as he tortured his enemies. Oh, here we go. I what took that the wrong way at first. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a great, massive. Let's not talk about Strahd's massive inch, organ, okay? 54 inch organ that he would flog with his enemies with. Go in the wrong direction. <laughs> He's legendary for a reason, everybody. Yes. Oh, in a bad way, this is bad. It was an organ made out of bone. This is getting way worse. They called it the Aqua Snake. Yeah. Sorry. sorry, Aqua Snakes. I'm sorry. Please. I'm sure Aqua Snakes is loving this. <laughs> they are expecting us whether we walk in the front door or whether we walk in the back door. It does not matter. They know we are here. Should we split up? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it is a terrible <laughs> idea. Everyone take a different <laughs> door. <laughs> they, can't, they can't block like four doors. I couldn't That's even true. finish. You may be the greatest musician I have ever heard, but... Tactically, perhaps you have a little bit to learn. No, but let's... I'm a big comedian, though, too. That was a... It was no, it was a great... It was a joke. Yes. Oh! oh. Mm. Yeah, it needs some work. Clearly a joke. Uh, oh, let's just go through the front yes. door here. Yeah. Please, behind me. Uh, yeah. Okay. Maybe I should go mm -hmm. in the front. If, they, if they're expecting us, then maybe there's a trap. All right. As you wish, Gadget. Mm. I trust your eyes. Careful, yeah. there's they a rapier so on the table. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, watch out for that. Uh, let's see, what do I roll to, can I check, is there a door? Are we headed towards a door? Yes, there is a large set <laughs> okay. of double doors in front of the door. I want to just, you know, check the door for traps. Okay, so you want to get closer. Yes. Uh, okay. Um, you want to check out that mausoleum? Yeah. So, mausoleum. this courtyard is a bit okay. misty and it's harder to see uh, here than it is uh, in a normal place, but with your gnomish eyes, you do have dark vision, right? Uh, yes. I believe everybody except Mirko has Somewhere. it. I don't need I dark have vision. Human. Um, I only see darkness. As you get closer, you see what looks like a well-dressed halfling speaking with what looks like a waiter. And as odd as this may seem, a wait staff in the front of Castle Ravenloft, it may not be that strange because as you look a little bit closer, you realize you can see right through their bodies. These are ghosts. Mm. And you see... I use those. You <laughs> <laughs> Actually, we could use ghost wait staff in the bar. You see uh, the, the halfling uh, kind of existed. looking into a book and kind of talking to someone behind him. And then the busboy runs off and he starts looking at mm -hmm. his book again. Uh, can I... Uh, so are they standing at the door? Uh, standing just outside the door. 
Check and the door out. closes. No, Actually, the door doesn't need to close because he just passes right through it. Mm. Tell him you're here for the ghost convention. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Castle Ravenloft is great for conventions. It's got big ballrooms. Uh, I'll go uh, a little bit. Can I get a little closer and just see if I can see anything else without, like, a sneak closer, basically? Yeah, make a self check. Mm. I'm just thinking, a hundred years after Straw, they just converted Castle Ravenloft oh. into the convention center for Barovia. <laughs> oh. I got a nine. It's a big empty space. Yeah. You got a nine. Is it not plus anything? Yeah, it is. I, got, I rolled a three. Oh, I see. So, as you stalk a little closer, hiding behind gravestones, uh, this little halfling who's looking at the book, uh, without even looking up, says, <clears throat> May I help you? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I'm here for the ghost convention. Oh, my God. <laughs> ghost <laughs> convention? Uh, yeah, someone told me, my, um, someone told me there, there was one. There is no ghost convention here. Oh, well, okay, maybe there should be, then. What, what are you doing here, then? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Gregory Cummings, which is an NPC uh, in, at Night's Deed. Thank you for oh. sharing the show. And I am the host of this very fine establishment known as The Haunt. It is one of the most elegant and upscale dining establishments. A very nice place to have your final meal before you pass on to the great beyond. Wait, people come here to eat and then die? No, 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 not people. Yeah. Not people, ghosts. Oh! Departed. Oh, so, uh, can I get a table? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm very certain you do not have a reservation at this establishment. Have you checked? Let me What's check. Guy's name? Let me look. Hmm? Red, 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 the Hathaway? Oh, guest. uh, Rahad. 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 I gotta write that down. Let me check. Like oh, you're it. still alive. So, yes, there is no reservation here for didn't you. Didn't he say last meal before you die? Well, that's what I, Yeah, didn't you say last meal before you die? I'm sorry, are you speaking to someone else out there? Uh, no, I just, uh, I hear voices. No, I said last meal before you pass on to the great beyond. Oh. I mean, isn't that, couldn't you argue that's the same thing? I mean, I'm just saying, you should be more specific. Yes, I will work on that. Now, uh, it seems that you are lost, and if you just turn around and head that way, you will find the exit. Oh, well, what, um, I'm real tired and, and thirsty. I've been traveling for a long time. It'd be really great if I could just come inside and, and rest before I go on. Uh. You seem nice. We do not have any place to rest here, you see. You have a whole Unless castle. you wish to somehow impale yourself with your sword and walk right in, then. Um, I mean, that's a door, isn't it? Can I just open it? Do not, do not. No, you are <clears throat> um, not welcome here. Uh, are, are the rest <clears throat> of us uh, are able to approach at this point? Sure. Or? No. Okay, what yeah, so, so Mirko will approach. Just Mirko? No, I'll, I'll come up as well. Okay. So the book that this halfling is checking, mm -hmm. is this a real book or a ghost book? It is a ghost book. Fuck. Um, <laughs> that is too bad, but that is fine. <clears throat> May I help you? We're here for the ghost convention. Yes, that line has already been said and not that Maybe funny. Maybe you should stop telling people there's a ghost convention I and people would stop coming. I said no such thing. Well, maybe one of your ghost friends did. We I did mean, hear about it and I came with my drum because I wanted to play for you guys. We're, see, we're a traveling band of of band members. Yes, Make a deception I check. Traveling a band of band members. Uh. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Um, um. Um, uh, 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 18. A band? Well, we already have a band inside, so we have no need for further music. Oh. And what, may I ask, instruments do you three play? I have the, uh, this? I right. have so many instruments, like, yeah. like, oh, pull cool. out, like She just carries them, like, <laughs> yeah. Oh, like. She's a roadie, I see. 
I see. We're here for the battle of the bands. You yeah. see, we compete against the other band. We're here to challenge them. Yeah, and Once again, that... this is a restaurant for ghosts. <laughs> well, that band died. Well, yeah, there are two ghosts back there that said, oh, hey, you should go to this thing because it would be really cool. You guys are a great band. It's now, true. I'm fairly certain I do know who you're talking about back there. And they are not very friendly. You know, you're not as friendly as that little boy told me you were. There's a little boy, and he was raving about the man with the book. Mm, yes, the I suppose. The book. Oh, he said you were so friendly, and we thought, well, we'll just walk right in, and we'll just, you know, go up there and 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 just talk to him. And I'm sorry. Can, so I, can I just friendly. stop you? Can I? Can I? Can I just stop you? Can I just stop you? Just one. Unless you have a reservation, I cannot allow you in. Little so. halfling man, what is your name? My name is Gregory Cummings. Gregory Cummings, Gregory. I'll tell you the truth of why we are here. Oh, this would be good. Is this... Go on. Do we want... Strahd is returning to Barovia. Do you know Strahd? Yes, I know of Strahd. Were you alive when Strahd was in power? I was. Do you remember the horrors that you experienced when Strahd was here? Strahd will close down your restaurant. Do you know this? He does not want the ghosts to eat. He will suck your soul and send you to the gates of hell. Is this what you wish? Make a persuasion check with okay. advantage. Okay. Persuasion. Mm, here to go, Mirko. Oh my god! <laughs> is that two ones? <laughs> Wait, yes. it is! Oh my gosh! One in a lifetime! <laughs> wow. wow! Well done, Mirko! <laughs> Mr. Snake Eyes here. Oh my god! Mirko's pants fall down <laughs> as he is uh, as he is gesticulating wildly. Uh, uh, he goes, oh, God, no! Ah, ah, yes, ah. I, 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 uh, I was around. That was embarrassing. I was around during his rule, and I was in his army, so to say, and although I do not want him to return, if he does, I will deal with it. Can I intimidate? Uh, oh, oh, well, tell me what you're going to do. Look. You check that book, and if we're not in there, you put our names in. Have have we thought of maybe just checking to see if our names are in there? I mean, well, but just re real quick. For her. He never, I never gave him my name. Can though. you just can you just check for a crag holder? Just before, I mean, just maybe maybe they were expecting us. Maybe. Sure. Crag holder. C R. I'm very. I I think I know how to spell names. I've seen a lot of them. C R A G. And I very much doubt your names are in here because. Once again, you are still alive, but I, to humor you, will check. And he takes a moment to flip through some pages and... Uh, uh, well, there, there is a crack holder in here. And what was, hmm, what was your first name? None of your business. What's what's the first name on the? <laughs> uh, you tell us what the first name is, and then we'll tell you what I'm going We'll first tell name you is. if it's us. I don't think that's how this works now. What is your first name? Could be. Well, this is Reeve Craigholder. Is he? Well, that is the name I have in here, but it's already. Does been... he not resemble Reeve Craigholder? Certainly, you've heard of him. Oh, I, I. I let him in a hundred years ago. He, he dined already. Well, He's checked off. Deja vu. Well, that's wonderful that you're related to Mr. No, I'm gonna Many. Are you sure we're not in the book? Go for it with disadvantage. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Oh. So this is a three that's or something. A six. Three. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, I, I don't think I have much to fear from you. So. Um, the, uh, this guy's just a ghost. Let's go inside. Can I just go up to the door? Push it open. Well, it does not budge. Walk. Oh, you I can't can go, he did the da thing. I, you. Please do not be rude. There are guards, mm. and I will not hesitate to get them. I do not want to cause a scene. I, I told do. Now, please, just leave on your own accord. And as he's saying this, a busboy walks up behind him and whispers something in his ear. Uh, it seems... <clears throat> that one of the guests requires your presence. Uh, Miss Cragholder. Uh, yes? They have requested your presence. <gasps> Wait, this isn't a good thing, is it? <laughs> uh, 
We've ha, never ha. had a living ha, ha. person enter, but I suppose if someone well. is their last wish to, to say goodbye, then I cannot deny that. Then so never. you yes. may enter. Great, well, I don't enter unless my friends enter. Well, I am sorry, they only request it and then the busboy comes back. <laughs> it seems they require all of your presence. Yeah, very right. well, that was okay. about to get messy, so that's good really for you. Good. Mm -hmm. Yes, wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, I will just let you in. Someone will find you and get you your seats. Just go on in. You guys go in? You should be better at customer <clears throat> service. It's your job. Oof. I walk yes. away. <laughs> It would be um, nice to be surrounded by the dead once oh, again. Let, uh, yes, of course, you are not spectral. You cannot walk through doors. And the doors swing open. Ah, yeah, um, the oh, smell of decay. And I'll go, we're not all savages. Here's your tip. And I will pour a little bit of ale in his hand. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's do this. <sighs> yes. Um, mm. So, you guys Ghost walk in food. and see an elegant ballroom filled with several other tables, all filled with other ghostly diners who are enjoying their meals and conversing quite happily. And uh, you walk inside and are seated at a table with uh, four, actually, sorry, five placemats. And one of them already has a, a person at the table. And this is a face you recognize, who, as you approach, stands up and looks at you and says, my good Miss Crackholder, it is good to see you again. This is Palure Swanson, who was recently deceased oh. at the attack in Barovia. You look good. Why, thank you. <laughs> Weren't you in the him? But he's dead now. I, but, you know. I, I, underst I understand, yes. I am a little beyond my time at this point, but... No, no, I know, it's just... Perfectly fine. Thank oh, you. You're dead. Gadget, good to see you. Miracle. A pleasure, and ghost Firk. man. I, thank you. Uh, Firk, it was a wonderful play up until that point, but... I hope you are here to make things right. Uh, we can't bring you back from the dead. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not what I'm okay. talking about. Because he wouldn't do that anyway. I mean, unless you have gold. I mean, we could, you know. Like, gold? Why do we lie to these people? <laughs> <laughs> there's clerics in, the, in, in Barovia could probably do it. They I, just need money. I don't think so. I don't think they would. I don't know. Perhaps. <laughs> I don't know any clerics powerful enough to do this. <laughs> No, it's, it's, it's especially it's, not in our small town. They would have to go to a much larger the biggest town. town in Barovia. My, my, good, named after my good men. No, huh? it's perfectly fine. I have I, lived a very good life, and there are many others that need that healing more than I do. So please. How not. did you know we were here? That we would come? Well, I I peeked out the door and I saw you. Oh. It is a very sort of funny I joke or us. something. I guess. I guess. No. Ghost joke. Uh, it is their last time to spend on this plane, so... You, uh... You haven't seen my ancestor, have you? Reeve? Reeve? No. The, I, I, I'm, he said that was a hundred years ago. I'm fairly well, certain. He said he let him in, but he's on the guest list. Oh, yes. I'm sure his name is in the book, but he would not be here. He's long gone at this point, I'm sure. Oh. Well, he was like, eating a meal um, for a hundred years. And at this point, uh, Gregory comes up to your table and is like, Looks like I'll be your waiter as well. Lives up the street. Thank you for the Thank 15. You. Um, Thank you, Liz. Gregory comes up to your table. <clears throat> Looks like I will be your waiter for this evening as well. So, oh, oh, really? what time? Uh, right. Can't you can, like, do something else? Can I afford a waiter? What time? Uh, mm -hmm. Let's just make fun of me. Yes. And waiter. What's your special? Before? We do not have specials. Oh, I, I, I see, you don't understand. This is your final meal. You can have whatever you want. Oh, I don't think we have time for this uh, food. Also, is it like real food or is it ghost food? I mean, we can eat ghost food. Well, I've not tried. We can try eating ghost food. You have ghost food? Let's try it. We have lemon cheesecake. Lemon cheesecake for you, yes. Oh, with a waffle. With a uh, waffle. Can I try one of everything I've never had? No. Oh. Sorry. 
Okay. That's Not enough time for that. <laughs> Gregory, I want to know if you've seen a man in a black cloak and a little boy with pale skin and red eyes pass through here. I have. Where did they go? Is he right over there? Yes. There's another set of large double doors. There's a short jaunt to that way. We've been doing this no. this whole time. And we just needed to go over the X. We just needed to ask this guy. Is, is that also where the restrooms are? Is that where the loo is? In, in that direction? I don't think ghosts can lose maybe... the loo. He's getting this. He's yes. getting this. Gregory, while we do appreciate your hospitality, and believe me, it's been very hospitable, there is a urgent issue that we need to deal with first. So, ladies, gentlemen, if we could take a rain check perhaps on this dinner, uh, we have a meeting with this cloaked man. Uh, if you are intending to go through those doors, yes. I will not have them open while these guests are dining. Now you can wait until the dance portion begins and then I think you should up. open them. Once again, that will do nothing to me. Well, so. Get some to those guys earlier. Yes, those were hateful spectral spirits. I am not hateful. You I... seem real hateful to me. You it's are willing true. to attack a ghost in a room full of ghosts. Yeah, because you won't open some doors. I don't feel like we're asking that I much. I have said I shall open the doors. Just let these spirits eat in peace first. Well, you're going to kill a little kid. I am not going to kill any children. Yeah, you are. If you don't let us through there right now. It's, it's called willful check. negligence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're just as guilty. Swanson and Swanson, uh, now listen, uh, just no, have, I, I say just have the meal and then the dance will start shortly and then you can sneak out. I got a nine. It has been a long time since I've had a lemon cheesecake. Mm. Very well. We will go through your song and dance. Ten. But if this boy has died, I will come for you. I'm shaking in my ghost boots. You yes. should be. I am not joking. You do not know what I am capable of. I yeah. certainly do not. I just met you. Very well. You're very rude. Ah! What would you like to eat? I am not hungry, thank you. You can order anything you want. Give me a f glass of your finest red wine. Glass of wine? Mm -hmm. Oh, so you secretly either. like wine all this time? I've always liked wine. Then why do you come to cry holders? And for the dwarf? I don't know. No reason. Um, I'd like... That's uh, uh, none of your business. One of your most powerful healing potions. <laughs> <laughs> and... <laughs> uh, a turkey leg. And... Uh, another healing potion. It counts as a drink. Right. It's a drink and a dessert. Now we can certainly create things that look like healing potions, but I guarantee they will not do anything. If you just enjoy imbibing them, I understand some people like that. I mean, they are pretty sweet, they taste, you know, they're pretty good. No, I mean, I really, like, okay. <sighs> what if we gave you a little tip? Wait, are you telling me you have physical coin to give me? We do have physical coin. Oh, how devilish, how devilish. I can go to the ghost market and spend that physical coin. How's that work? It doesn't. I'm oh. just humoring. There's no, I can't use money. Well, how, about I give you, how about I give you some ghost coins then? What would I do with them? I'd take them to the ghost market. She's not getting it. She really doesn't understand. Uh, it's it's okay. for the gnome then. I don't uh, think there is actually a ghost market. Uh, avocado blueberry pancakes with some french fries. That's this thing. And, uh, yeah, and spicy ketchup. That sounds great. Yeah. All right. You have to be here. Those will be out shortly. Thank you very much. And he walks away. <sighs> um, so a moment later, uh... Mirko Brutes. <laughs> A moment later, Mirko broods. Yes! Um, a man stands <laughs> up at a different up table. Brooding. Mm. A man stands up at a different table and says, Here, here let's have a toaster! Raise your glasses! Shh. Here's a toast to nothing going wrong ever again! Because we're ghosts! Don't say that last part. To, to nothing, nothing going, going wrong ever again! again. Cheers! That's from Lives Up the Street. Thank you very much for that toast. Thank you. Also, we've unlocked. Also part of the everyone lives up the street. We've unlocked, chosen by the cards, which means one of you guys, Fierk, 
Förrk. 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 The beggar. As you hold this card, you hear a voice in your head say, "The thin form of desperation flows through, sustaining itself on gold or blood." So you can spend that at the start of any combat for a special effect. Ooh. Cool. Could be special. Could be deadly. We'll see. Um, so your meals arrive, and they are the best-looking meals you've ever seen. You got everything you imagined in your head when you were ordering that meal, and more. Can we come mm. here all the time? They even put no. some lemon rind. <laughs> it's free, yeah. Lemon rind, free food. We can live forever. On, I mean, free food. We won't. We won't have to work. Um, can uh, all of you make perception checks? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ooh, Four. Hey, baby. Four. Where are you? I'm so enthralled in my cheesecake. Yeah, you have no time Very. for anything else. <laughs> Eight. Eight. Seven. Sixteen. Sixteen. Brooding allows a man to look around the room. Mirko, you and you <laughs> alone deadly. look around the room, and after inspecting the faces for a while, you realize you recognize some of them. You recognize them as some of the people who were killed earlier in the attack that happened in Barovia. Oh. And then you also recognize one other face. Oh. An old, old woman with warts on her face. This is the old hag. And she's sitting there dining with some other ghosts, and she sees you looking over, and she raises a glass to you and takes a sip. I will stand up and say, it appears that the hag is joining these people in the afterlife. And I will approach her table. Okay. You approach her table. Wait, the hag is dead. Yes, it would oh. seem. You guys all oh, did right. know that. You did see, that. You did see a that. vision. Yeah. You all saw oh, the vision. Oh, we all saw that. That's right. That yeah. was, in, that was in, uh, in your heads that you did see it. That's so you approach right. that table. <clears throat> Mirka, it's so good to see you again. A pleasure, I'm sure. I am... Um, it is regrettable that you are in this position that you were in, but hopefully you led a... Good life. I think I did. I lived for hundreds of years. Yes. And how many babies did you kill in those hundreds of years? As you say that, the faces of the ghosts of the table were smiling and drinking happily, kind of just... <laughs> just out of curiosity. Mirko, I have regrets, but oh, you have I don't regrets, think do you? this is the place to bring them up. I am sorry for all I've done. And in the end, I just wanted what was best for Damien. Not as sorry as you should be. You're right. You're right. Well, what did you do to him? Who is this boy? This boy, or so Rahadin thinks, is the body of Strad, reborn. And so he asked me to age him so that he would be ready to take the soul of Strad when it comes in. Wait, Rahadan asked you to age him. He did. And I did for a while, but I grew fond of the boy and... I refused to hand him over and, well, here I am. Wait, is Rahadan the father of the boy? No. Oh. Eh. No! Goodness. I know, elves, oh. right? <laughs> <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I'd like to get back to my final meal. Yes, enjoy your final time on this earth, Hag. And at that point, you hear a bell ring, and a ghostly procession starts playing some music. All the ghosts start rising out of their chairs and picking off partners or just dancing by themselves, and they begin gathering to the center of the room. Ugh, finally. And Swanson at your table says, well, it seems it's time for me to go. Good night. And he walks over to the center of the room and finds a partner. It has been a pleasure, Swanson. He nods to you. And they you start dancing. You are good for an elf. 
<laughs> he th- throws you the bird. Uh, <laughs> and they start dancing. And as they do, they start slowly just floating into the air. And as you guys look up, you can see a spectral sky in, instead of a ceiling. And they all start rising towards it, like dancing boys. very happily. Mm. And as they do, uh, Gregory kind of peeks over and says, Psst, you can go now. Oh, why do you stay here and you don't go when you work and you don't go there? Eh, it's a living. What, you don't, don't need me, I guess it's an unliving. Yeah. Uh, oh, we should go. <laughs> All right, let's go. On that note. Let's go. So, the doors open. Fair and you guys. Yes. Yes, it does. Walk on through. Um, let's see. Let's go through Great. We are great. We are 25 away from the next tier. And oh. what's that, tier four? Oh, we were raided. Tier oh. four. Oh. Wait, Hey! Exploding hey, dice! Exploding dice! Oh, exploding dice! Exploding dice. Yeah, follow Welcome. Exploding Thank dice you. on Twitter. Hey, what's up, guys? So as you guys... I like your Twitters. ...leave the very elegant banquet hall, you head off into a very dark and dimly lit hallway. Uh, let's see... Hmm... So, you guys approach a set of another, another large set of double doors, and they are slightly ajar, as if inviting you inside. What do you do? I mean, it's an open door. We should probably go in it. Gadget, you want to check for traps? Yeah. I will check for traps. Go for it. What do I roll for this, uh, investigation or...? Investigation, yeah. Uh, You can say anything and I'll believe you. Yeah, how are you playing? It's an 11. It takes you more time to read it than it does to roll. Hold on! Um, So you check the door frame and any of the floor panels nearby the door, and Mm -hmm. you don't suspect any traps being there. No traps! Great, we should, we should... We should go in. Maybe we should go in banging loud or stealthily. We... I maybe just go. Like okay. we'll just go yeah, maybe, in. Maybe we, we just, just go inside. Okay. All right, let's do it. Yes. I'll go first. Uh, I'll I'll go last. So I. Was that a short rest, by the way? Eating. Um. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Actually, chat unlocked final dining. So, oh, you yeah. guys. Uh, each gains six temporary hit points on top of your maximum. Ooh-wee. And oh. you also regain a spell slot of your oh. choice. Yes. Oh, good. A spell and, slot. Oh. Uh, I know some of you don't have spell slots, so you, uh, Furt, can recover. You have something that's a one one per long rest. Action surge? Uh, uh, no. Uh, the, the, I recovered the action search in the second win. Do you have anything else you can recover rest. other than... I can recover my hit dice. I can redo my hit dice after a long rest. Because I use two two of my... No, just like dice. just uh, like either spell slot or like feet thing. Anything once per day. No, because my die. superiority die and all that is a recover after short rest. Okay, then you can so. gain back one hit die. And do you, like, not use it, but you can... You have one more hit die to use when you use a short rest. Did you say five or six? Six. six? six. Six temporary hit points. Do you have anything you can recover that's once Ooh, per day? Once yeah. per long rest? I don't think you do. I don't think so. So you can get back one hit die. Okay. Just I haven't used any so far. Thank okay. you for unlocking that chest. Yes, yeah, thank, thank you, you for yes, unlocking you. final but, dining. But that was not a short rest. No. Okay. That was not a short rest. Um, it's better than a short rest. Do you want a pencil? I just, you, you know, I had one and I just. What would you guys like to do? Well, yeah. shall we enter this yeah. door? Yeah. Yeah. This I'll go through. Beckoning us. Okay. Actually, it's just a door. It's not doing much. It's beckoning I like, it's like beckoning. crazy. Yeah. Well, very I see blurry. faces screaming at me. Oh, well, I don't see Come, that. Come, Jacko, to your door. That, you, uh, do you not see that? Uh, do you no. want to go first? <laughs> yes. I'm not afraid. I mean, it's We not... need to save the boy. So. He's in grave danger. Okay. Let's I, move this stuff aside. All of Barovia is in danger. <gasps> oh, this is going to be sad. It's transition music. It's missing. Mm. Should be moving. Basically. 
this. Oh, it's awful, awful wet. That looks like really unsteady. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was just built that way. So you guys can put yourselves by this door. That's where you're entering. Nice. Ha! Oh. oh, my hand. So you guys enter a large chamber with a, a very large throne in the center, and you see a man in a long black cloak sort of sprawled out on the throne with his leg over the armchair, and he's holding a chalice in one hand. Can I borrow your chalice? Oh. This one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The skull one seems a little too much. Yeah, it's a bit a little on the nose, right? He's holding a chalice in one hand and a scimitar that he's kind of just playing with in the other. And he looks up as you walk in and says, Well, well, you're finally here. Welcome. Come in, come in, come in. <laughs> and you recognize him immediately as the man you saw in yes. your vision uh, when you were looking at, uh, through Bernie's eyes. Where's Damien? Ah, where is Damien? I'm afraid you're just a tad bit too late. Ah, it seems his frail little body was just not strong enough to contain the soul of the Dark Lord. Alas, he has passed, and so has my opportunity to bring my master back to this land. All is lost. All is lost. Uh, do you think that's funny? I think so. Why did you do it then? Why didn't you wait until he was stronger or older? Or, I mean, why do it at all? But it seems like a pretty big risk. I don't know if I believe you. It was no risk at all. A small child means nothing to me to bring back our beloved Strahd. Yes, but now you can't do it. Well, time will tell, I suppose. Where is we his... We will find him. Where is his body? We need to return it to his mother. His body? Ah, yes, I have it. And he holds out a bag. It is in ashes, I'm afraid. Uh, it, like I said, his body, it could not hold it. <clears throat> I will go up and take Can I do an insight check? Oh, yeah. Uh, sure, with disadvantage. Uh, 11? Was, yeah, Okay. Um, he looks sincere, but also drunk. Okay. <laughs> That's uh, how I am a lot of the time. <laughs> um, I will, I will take the ashes from him. He, he throws a bag on the floor. I will, take I will it, pick them up. Take it, I do not care. <laughs> do these look like cremains? They don't look like burned remains. They look like if someone is incinerated, or, uh, like, disintegrated. But they, but they're not like. There's no smell of uh, of wood. Make an arcana check, actually. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Twenty four. Is that good? That's pretty damn good. Wow. Yeah. With arcana, you can uh, reach in and pinch tell a little bit. Uh, the texture feels right, but you don't smell anything. And you would imagine a corpse would smell pretty bad, even if it was disintegrated. Yes. He's holding, I promise. <laughs> All right, well, if you murdered the boy, you got to go. Oh, no. I, I have to go now. Me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't I, know why we're talking to him. I do not wish to fight. I do not wish I have nothing left to fight for. <clears throat> well, I, then accept your punishment. Uh, da, 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 I, I will defend myself, and I have slain thousands of men in the name of my lord, and I will continue to do so, but do yes, you truly wish to test me? But I am You're no fine. man. I'm a dwarf. I'm a I killed thousands of dwarves, too. Oh, okay. We'll see. That Hundreds of dwarves. But we're crag holders. Right. One very special dwarf. No, Strad killed him. Did he? Yeah. Pretty sure. <laughs> 
right. Anyway, you're going to face punishment one way or another. He gets up and dusts himself off and says, All right then. And he takes out his scimitar with a flourish and holds it up. Then let's begin. Let's roll initiative. All right. Is that not a... That must be in a, one of the other books. All right. Fnaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
feel like this was a trap. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. Was this smell. an illusion? Uh, roll an arcana check. 15, 20. Dirty 20? Dirty 20. Uh, yeah, you sense at this point that it was. Because you didn't smell anything from that bag, uh-huh. this was likely all illusory magic. Probably from the heartstone that he's been using this whole time. And from that 20, you feel that there's still some illusion left in this room, coming from the far wall behind the throne. I will march to the far wall. Okay. Bring out my quarter staff. Whoa. So when you get to about this point, mm-hmm. that wall fades away. Mm. Enough of your tricks, wizard. To reveal another room. Oh boy. Oh boy. Did you get it? Oh. I got one of them. I, I know, I got one earlier too. Okay. I think I stunned him because he yeah. was over here. These bastards are. Oh, oh I got this one. These too. flying bastards! That's another one! It only counts as one! <laughs> uh, oh, I see. Great. Here so, we go. the wall fades away, and you see a large alcove with three gates. And in the center gate, shackled and chained to the walls of it, is a young man screaming and writhing in pain. Mm. And it takes a moment to realize it, but this is him. This is Damien Tominsky, tortured and aged by dark magic. <sighs> you can see tears pouring down his eyes. And upon seeing you, he immediately begins calling out, uh, Uncle Mirko, I'm catching with anybody, please help me! And he's, you see chains on his hands and arms, and you see a dark cloaked figure walk out from behind one of the gates and approach you. Very good, Mirko! <laughs> well. Yes, it was a cute trick. I knew it would not take long for you to figure it out, but... Soon, Sa- Strahd's soul will walk through these gates and claim his new vessel, and Barovia will be born anew. Isn't that sound very nice? It just, what, doesn't it just sound wonderful? Your life ends here, elf. Well, don't worry. There are many other souls coming, and they seek new vessels as well. And he pulls out his scimitar, for real this time. Let's roll initiative. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you want to use anything uh, card-wise? Your card will still go off. We're still, okay. we're still wizardy. The wizard is still there. Yes, excellent. Ooh, that's much better. Um, Fierk. Uh, sure, I'll use. I'll use Fierk. The Why not? You use what? I'll use this. Great. What is it? The beggar. The beggar. Mm. It's probably not going to be good, but whatever. We well, don't know. It's going to be very good. The beggar. Please the thin form of desperation flows through, sustaining itself on gold or blood. At the beginning of the encounter, all creatures lose 3d6 gold pieces. Oh no! If they do not have <laughs> no. this gold, they take 1d6 damage. I, think I, have, I have 10 gold, so 3d6, you said? Well, 3d6. You lose that did many all, gold. Did we all start with 10? Uh, more than likely you started with 10. It should say on there somewhere. Right, At the very five. bottom right there? You get 15? Six. Wait, where does it say? Oh, oh, oh 15, okay. So it's at the bottom now. center. There's like slots. Oh! So what if I roll 12 for my gold? I mm. like 10. So you'll, you'll use 1d6 hit points, which I'll roll. So you take six damage. Oh, oh. Give me one of those, baby. I, don't, I, don't have I need it. I want it. I crave it. So the it. gold vanishes from your pocket Three. as a ghostly beggar comes and says, A little help, please. Oh, yeah, sure. A little help. Yeah. You don't have enough either? Mm-mm. You lose four. I have no gold. What I have did no you need roll? for gold. What did you 17. Oh. And I had 12. Yeah, I'm fine. I rolled six. Okay. Oh. Ten. You're good. Yeah. Everybody else loses that many hit points. <sighs> Okay. Uh, and you see, uh, together, you see Rahad and toss uh, the ghost some coins and says, <laughs> "Nothing to me." So we know he's got money on him. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know how that helps us though. Yeah. Oh, when he's dead, it will help. So he's gonna roll a new initiative, but you guys will remain the same. Oh, unless as we were before. are using the pocket watch. Did uh, you just tell us to roll again? I mean. 
I did say that, I guess. But if you, you want to keep the old one, yes. you can. I, I got give you old no. one. I got a 14. I got a 15, yeah. so I want the new one. I got a 17. Okay. But regardless, I'm using that pocket watch. I mean, I don't feel like I need Do you want to see what he does first? Yeah. He rolled a 7, so he's like here. I mean, but I rolled 14. Okay. So I'll do just a new initiative. What was your new initiative? 15. Great. Mine's 17. 17. 17. Oh, shite. Mirko is fast on the draw. He's been waiting for this moment. Fear? Four. Oh. <laughs> oh. Chris? Sorry, Fear. 14. Oh, get hurt. You got 14 too? I got 15. Oh, great. He got a nine, so he's there. Um, so, here is your objective, or as you can see it from here. Should you choose to These gates are flowing with planar energy, and you can see, at this point, souls walking out of them. Uh-oh. Ugh. Oh, man. So every turn, every round, two will walk out of this gate. And the way I'm, I'm running these, to be very simple, is that they move their, their movement, which is gonna be, uh, I believe, four spaces. And if they're next to you at the end of their turn, you're gonna take one damage. That's it. They're not gonna roll attack range, just keep it super simple. To kill them, you just have to hit them once and do any damage. Just hit them, is mm. all you have to do. So they're very easy to kill, but they also can gang up on you because there are going to be a lot of them. Um, and you guys have three rounds before the Soul of Strahd enters. Oh boy. Oh. And then, well, it's likely game over. We'll see. I mean, uh, I think us rounds. level three players can take Strahd. You can, you can choose to. <laughs> Uh, you can choose to fight him, or destroy the gates, or something else. Rescue the boy? I mean, you're trying to rescue the boy, but, I mean, see what you can do. All right. I want to use You guys ready? Very good. I don't know how. Yes. It is your turn. All right. Um, yeah, I will step this. to here. This probably won't work. One, two, three, and, uh, <clears throat> and I will take my wand out. Mm-hmm. It glows green. Yeah. Green. It waves it in the air. <sighs> Ah, Not Mirko. feeling well, are you? I admire your courage, Mirko. Uh, and a, uh, uh, a plague of locusts erupts. Ew. And the locusts turn into pustules and they explode. And he is covered with goo. Disgusting. Yes, gross, disgusting goo. Where's Which I will re-roll. Mm. Oh, because thank I you. hope that it will hit him hard. Oh, I have so I'm many. Using bronze for Tom's instructions. 12 back here? Wow. What is that? Does a 14 hit? A 14 does not hit. Fudge! Okay, well, I am finished with my turn. Anything happen on a miss? No? Nope. Okay, Okay. that's your turn. Uh, not, not good job. I need to take a healing potion. Okay. Uh, how do I, what do I roll? You roll 2d4 plus 4. Or sorry, plus 2, I believe. <laughs> 2d4 plus 2. It should be on the screen. Yeah. Right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Mm. So you heal for nine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I believe you can do it as a bonus action. Oh! I believe you have cunning action. I uh, okay. Then what are, are these like statues or? They're uh, sarcophagi, I guess. Just and what's this? Is this rubble? That's just rubble. Yeah, it's an old decrepit room, has not been taken care of. Uh, and this is the throne. That's a throne. And where's the bad guy? Which one uh, is he? He's there. Okay. He's up here. Yeah, he's right there. I'll move um, <laughs> <laughs> right here. He's working out great for you. It is right. Can I? Can, how high is this? Uh, you can jump on there if you wanted to. Who's this? That's it's Mirko. Mirko. Oh, that's you. <laughs> well, yeah. I'll it's jump Mirko on. against the world. So that's, your distance is, ha is 25, so. Yeah, I gotta One, see two, right three, here. four, five. So I go there. Or sorry, five. Uh-huh. And then you're double moving? Uh, well, I don't have, I, I move it normal to climb. Sure, but you can only move, this is 25, this is one Oh, move. I see, I see what you're saying. Did you want to uh, yeah. double move? I, I'm just trying to figure out if I can, if I can aim over this. I mean, I guess I could if I You could go to like here, like, I mean, you could get to here and still aim past it. Okay, that's what I want to do in the right. I'll, baby. Shoot, I'll shoot with my short bow. Go for it. Uh, 18. Don't forget, you guys have 10 pit points too. The six. Oh, yeah. So go through those before. You took away three of mine. Yeah, I got three. Great. Okay. Six, 10 pit points. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. You took Eight, away 18. Four. 18 is what you hit? Yeah. Great. Yeah, you hit him. Nice. 
Did I sneak attack for, for, for first blood? No, you did not. Well, damn it. Uh, three damage. Woo! He takes it with Take a... Take that! Feel the thunder. He tries to deflect it with his, um... That's right, you... Scimitar. There's more where that came from! Shut it, bro! Thank you, Thank you. That's awesome. Thank Thanks you. so much. Yes. Thank you for that. Should count that towards the Thousand tears. Thousand You guys need it. I'm thousands. Uh, um, we need the yeah, we will count that towards the tears. Yeah, we're going to. We are? Okay, great. Yeah, yeah. sure. I just talked uh, to our executive producer and he approved it. <laughs> so. uh, Grace, it's your turn. Oh, um, okay. I'm going to... I'm going to move 25 to this side. Thank you. Here. Gadget? They're on there? I don't know what the... The distance is on my sling. Uh, I should say probably okay. pretty far. Uh, uh, yeah, no, it doesn't say. It doesn't right. say. I can look it up real quick. Please, Ooh, I will look it up. Bastion, thank you. Bastion, Bastion fees. Thank you for having some. Bastion, Bastion, Bastion fees. Bastion. Parlez-vous français? Oui, je parle un peu français. What? Sling distance. Eh. Eh. Um, yeah, that is a simple so. range. Hold on. It is simple ranged sling. 30, 30, 120. Yeah. Yeah, 30 and oh. then 120 with disadvantage. So right now it'd be 120. Yeah, so it's disadvantage. It's farther than 30 feet. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm gonna go for the creature. Uh, him or one of the these guys? One of one of these guys on this side. Great. Um bum, bum. Bum, bum, ba, da, da. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Bye, die. Uh, Goodbye, die. What do you need? D20. D20. Gone Damn. forever. That would have been nice and bad I could. Uh, so that's a hit. Yeah. Both of those were fine. Uh, okay. Cool. So it's 1d4 damage, but just hitting any of these, you will kill them. Okay. So you kill yeah. this one immediately. So Great. this soul disappears into the ether. That's one down. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Good. Is that your turn? Anything else? Any movement? Okay, cool. You already moved. Uh, I already moved. All right. It is... Rahadin's turn. He's going to pre- approach Mirko. Ah! We meet something. again! Let's dance! <laughs> I admire your courage. It was not long ago that you were a coward who fled while the wolves fed on your friends. Oh, you shouldn't, you shouldn't say that. I look at you and all I see is death. Oh. Come meet your fates! You will see plenty of death. Uh, he's going to attack you three times. What the flitch? <laughs> Uh, well, that's a two. Ha-ha! Mirko survives! He's gonna re-roll it. Re-roll? I mean, he has... I have so many. That is a 15. It is a miss. Oh, because you have armor, right? Aha! Yes! So I'm, that's a I'm miss. I'm protected magically. Uh, uh, that is 18. <laughs> Still miss? Uh, 18 is a miss with my shield. You, you activate shield? Yes, I activate my shield as a reaction. Okay, so that takes a spell slot. Just mark that down. Oh, yeah. So your your AC is now what? Uh, 21. 21. Blackjack. Okay, here we go. Here comes the blackjack. <laughs> That's three misses. Your pure immortal weapons do not scare me. Um, as he, I am Mirko. I am immortal. As he approaches you, though, you start hearing voices in your head. Oh. Hundreds and hundreds oh, no. of souls what else is new? screaming. So make a... Uh, wisdom saving throw. Okay. As this deathly choir rings in your head. Mmm. Quiet. The voices are particularly disturbing tonight. Ooh. That is a 14. Wait, no. Wisdom saving throw. Uh, 16. That is a pass. Woohoo! You take four damage. What? Four oh. psychic damage. Really? As it still rings in your head, yes. <sighs> well, I guess that's as good as I could have gotten. Uh. Mirko just defended against three attacks. Uh, mm. this thing is gonna mm. walk near you. One, two, three, four. That's going to hurt. One, two, three, four. You take three damage for three of these being next to you. Mm, all right, all right, all right. It is now. Everybody, calm down. Felix, turn. Um, can I see uh, using stone cutting or whatever? Is there a way to, to maybe destroy these portals? Uh, stone cutting. Yeah. Uh, you guys are dwarves, so you can yeah. tell these are very old gates, and yes. Doing enough damage to them will destroy them. Okay. Um, 
All right, I'll hold on to that. Uh, let's see, can I make it up next to him? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, you'll you, be here. You guys, after your moves, move back 15 feet. <laughs> <laughs> From him. What? Move what back. does that mean? Move back 15 feet after you're done. Do I need done. to bring out a tape measure? I can hear you, little dwarf. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Uh, I'm going what? to. I'm going to. What? Uh, what? <laughs> Who's talking? I'll hit the one to Who my right. Okay, one go for right. it. Uh, yep. 17. That's a hit. Any amount of damage kills him, so that one is dead. Um. And that's all I can do. Okay. That is right, one round. Right now. That is one round gone. It gets hurt if I move back. You have two rounds left. Oh, right. And I can't move and then attack and then move again. Uh, I see. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mirko, um, as you are surrounded by these hordes of zombies... Well, partially, they're all in front of me. One of them uh, holds out a hand and gives you a haunted Barovian coin. Oh, don't touch him! How very generous of you. This is uh, Bastion Fails, gives a reroll to the gatekeeper from the VHS, VHS game Nightmare. Yay! Which is Tyler, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, was that you that I was on? No, no, it was somebody else. Wait, no, 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 somebody else on Twitter. Must have been Bastion. Referenced, I, I don't, I... If somebody else, I know I follow Bastion Feast. Bastion... Bastion Feast I'm gonna guess on, Bastion. on Twitter, but it was some all other dudes. Yeah, he's, he's, he's all of the mentions. Um, it is your turn. What? I believe so. Mirko? Um, I could be doing this all wrong. No, no, I think you are absolutely correct. Because uh, Kirk just went, yes? Uh, just a, so, bonus actions, do those happen after or before um, your turns? Bonus happens on your turn. Reactions so, can happen at any time. Does bonus happen? Do you have to take your standard action before you can take a bonus action? You can action? take it whenever you want. You okay. can do bonus first, then Got action. It. Cool. All right, well. <clears throat> Uh, finding himself in a bit of a pickle, um, Mirko takes his magic wand and goes Woof! and vanishes. Okay. Wait, is this a real thing? Yes. One, what two, is this? three, four, five, six. And shows up over here. Okay. Um, oof. Vanishing in the pile of mist. Is this Misty set? Uh, yes. Great. And coalescing 30 so feet away. You appear right next to Damien, and he is surprised to see you and crying out, but you feel horrible energy around you. Uh, make a oh strength saving throw. Strength saving Grub. throw? Grub! Thank, Thank you for you. that. Thanks for the, so the tenor grubs. Okay. A strength saving throw, huh? Yeah. Mm hmm. Hmm. Do I dare? No, you know what? Let's not. Because I think I'm going to roll <laughs> fucking <laughs> poorly. That's a critical fail. Oh, oh no. Can't even use Bastion Fees. Is so amazing. You feel horrible energy pulse around you, okay. and you look around to see the source of it, and you see a ruined circle just below where uh, Damien is being kept, and this energy starts pushing you and forces you back three squares because you failed. Okay. Uh, and you take eight damage on a fail. Oh! <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Just gonna die. Um, okay, you know what? That's fine. A lot has uh, happened. That here. was your bonus, by the way. Yes, that was my bonus action. So you still have an action. action. Yes. Um, so uh, uh, he weaves magic incantations. His eyes burn red. His hair stands up on end. Whoa. Flame emits from his wand, and he points it at at Rahadan. Rahadan. And he says, burn, you creature of the night. Nice. Oh. Come on. Uh, and he fires a scorching ray. OK. He also takes out a little candle before he does. Oh. And he blows it out with his wand. <gasps> oh, nice. And it erupts. Triple advantage. Golden triple advantage. I was dreaming of this moment. OK. So ray number one. Hits a 16? 16 hits. Woo! Ray number two! 15? 15. Also hits? Yes! Ray number three. What? What, what do I. 
What, what does that say? I can't see. Five it's, and a three. it's a ten. It's hey, you two out of three in bed. What, what's the damage on that? It's not great though. What's the um, damage? Oh, oh, oh! Actually, you know what? I keep forgetting. We are, um, we are under some special. Oh yeah, do you have some rules? Oh, you had two. Oh, yeah. So it's plus two, uh, but it would still be five, wow. ten, twelve. Twelve is probably not enough, right? It is not. Okay. Uh, do I add force dice to each one of these beams, or just overall? Oof. Uh, yeah, you hit twice. I'll give it to you. Woohoo! Okay. I'm gonna roll these all together. Because this is like, this is his blaze of glory moment, because he is about to die. Yeah! Woo! Oh, that's, mm, that's not great. Uh, it's okay. So 10, 9, 20. Uh, 20 points of damage. Oh, hot damn! <laughs> Yeah, he takes this blow and is not happy about it and turns back towards you. Um, <laughs> all right, uh, Gadget, it is your turn. Uh, um, also, real quick, chat has unlocked tier four. The oh. deal of a lifetime. Thank you for unlocking that, chat. No deal. Oh, you don't want to make the deal? No deal. We'll see if oh, it comes go up. Go to the banker. Banker. Don't right. press go. I'm getting a go call to from jail. the banker. Uh, so... Such a good show. Oh, also... Yeah. Such a great show. Such good entertainment. Sorry, I should have done this beforehand, but... I did audience work for that show did for you? eight hours one day. Yeah, It was the worst! God, it sucks so much. But you got to meet Howie Mandel. No! I got to see the banker, though. So what I was is... like, hey, you're supposed to be mystery, but I, you're just walking around. <laughs> anyway, that was kind of fun. What does damage mean to those guys? Like, what like, what counts as damage? Damage hitting them. does? Well, I got a bag of ball bearings, and I'm wondering if I threw those. I mean, you still have to make an attack roll for throwing each one. Each one, so I can't, like, throw a handful, like a scatter shot? Well, no, because that'd just be like, they'd just fall on them, and that wouldn't really But if I throw it real hard... <laughs> it would be oh, one... No. It'd be okay. one. It'd be one very incredible yeah. throw. I, I will let you try it, but it, you will have to hit like a, a, a DC of like oh, great shot! Like twenty five or something to throw that many ball bearings. Okay, well I want to climb up strength. on the throne first of all. Um, you are there. Ah. And how does it feel? Yeah, I'm gonna throw it like down at as many as I can get. I'll throw this way so I can at least try to get those two. I mean, this is the thousand ball bearings, but I'll just, you know, take a handful. Yeah, I imagine the, the less you throw, the better your aim will be. I'll let you do it in like a line, so you can hit like these four if you hit them. Okay. But gonna it, it is going to be 25, like I said. Uh, I don't even know if I can get that. Hold right. on. Yeah, it would be What? I be don't dex. get any dex? Yeah. I can't get that. What's I your dex? I plus two. Uh, really? Oh, I guess you do. I was gonna count your proficiency, but that the highest you can get is twenty-four. But hey, a nat twenty does Gadget, does hit. If you're doing what I think you're doing, take some inspiration. Yeah, I am. Oh, you wait, don't have inspiration. Yet. Oh, you don't have to roll it. So you can add only a, if you need it. One d six. You can add one d six to this, and so you can not, make if, it with if, that. If not, then you can just hold it for next. Yeah. Your next. No, time. I'll do it. Well, no. <laughs> no, don't, oh, don't roll it. Well, I see yeah. one. I don't know what the tiny one is. It's a four. D don't use the bardic yeah, don't inspiration. Don't use inspiration until you roll. Gonna help. Oh, well. Just kidding. It doesn't count. It doesn't. The bardic inspiration. I think they fell behind me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Great. You try. Don't fall on those. Watch out for the ball bearings. <laughs> Grease, you fall on them and die. Oh. Uh, it's worth a shot. Anything else for you? Uh, I mean, I don't know that I can do anything else. That was your attack action. Just see yeah. you like pulling out these ball bearings and they just all, oh. <laughs> it's just like, whoops. You just hear like that all over the Grace, it's your turn. Okay, I want to go uh, towards these guys. One, two, three, four, five. Um, There's one movement. Okay, and I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna sling uh, I'm gonna actually sling at the guy. This one? Yeah. Great. That one. Make an attack roll. Um, we get extra on this? Uh, That's gonna hit no matter what. Uh, okay. Cool. But so. you don't need to roll damage because they okay, die! Okay. Um, That's, that one's dead. That soul pops. And I'm gonna say... Mirko! Yes! Don't you look so grim. Whoa! Oh, no. Grobach the Redeemer. Thank you for the 24. Thank you very much. Grobach the Redeemer. 
Ooh, that means we You're are. You're not dying on my watch. <laughs> and a Ooh. healing word you for six. Hey. Oh, that, nice. okay, Miracle's great. Miracle's feeling okay now. We've unlocked tier five. Crack holders might. 18. Oh. Hmm. I like All the right. sound of that. Okay. You know who's a crack holder? Grizz. Um, and you? Oh, right. Yeah, me too. Uh, so. We have chosen the form of the Redeemer, and it is Grobach. So you healed and moved. Anything else from you? Nope. Okay, it's Rahadin's turn. And him seeing you go over to Damien mm -hmm. uh, angers him, so he's gonna move here and. Uh, Actually, wait, no, he's gonna Misty Step also here. He has Ooh. one more of those. Oh, good job. Nice Misty Step. Thank you, <laughs> thank <Wow>. you. <laughs> and then he cuts you. <laughs> uh, your AC is now 16? Uh, yes. 16, okay. Yeah, he, there's no flanking, right? You don't use no, the flanking No, flanking rules? is not a thing. Okay, it is a 16. Uh, that is an 18. What does that, uh, what does that adjust to? Was that a jo oh, uh, 23. <laughs> okay. That hits! Oh, you want to use another shield? Not yet. I got you. Uh, you want, I guess I'll roll damage for that just in case. Uh, I don't know how much HP you have left, but. Which HP did I have? That's a good question. You take 10 slashing. No. Ouch! It hurts! I'm not afraid. I'm finally coming to meet okay. you. Okay, here comes the second one. That is a 13. Missed. Oh. He's gonna reroll. That's not 13. Ah. <laughs> uh, third attack. I'm not afraid of you. Is a 11. He's gonna reroll that. Miss. Get rid of all these so things I got back there. That's way worse. Uh, so that's a miss. Woo! But then he's gonna focus once more. What? Into your eyes. And use Deathly Choir. No. So saving oh, for wisdom. Oh boy, okay. Mm. Get out of my head! Ah, Listen yeah. to their voices, Mia. Ah. Listen to them. Oh, we roll. Oh, okay. Bronze. <sighs> what is that? Uh, yeah, that is a uh, wisdom saving throw. Whiz. Yeah, it is a six. A uh, six? Six. That is a failure. So you are going to take six psychic damage. Okay. That is fine. <coughs> that is fine. Everything is fine. Uh, it's a zombie's turn. Mirko. Uh, I think you've killed him. You take five. <laughs> oh, everything is not okay. Well, I tried, Damien. I tried. And you topple. No! Okay. Oh, no. Sucking it down. Okay. You oh, took no. some of them with you. Yeah. Good. So all you have to do is just fall like this and take them with you, and they would have died. You yeah. all see Mirko's body hit the ground in front of Rahadi. The no. And then the bodies hit the floor. There's a flare in the portal, and you see a ghastly spirit emerge. Oh no! And say to the rest of you standing, mm, I could bring him back for a price. Because Chad unlocked the deal of a lifetime. It's gonna cost the three of you something to bring him back. Do you accept? I only have 10 gold. Oh, I <laughs> do not away, want beggar. money. <laughs> <laughs> I beggar. Do not. I, I already gave you, I don't have. I do not want any money. What's your return? What you, you will give me all of your candles, all of your rerolls, to bring him back from the dead. Does he also get hit points? <laughs> he will gain half his health. I the only. Oh no, you've got two. I've, I've oh. got one reroll, but you have to bring my friend back. It's a small price to pay. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh my dear. We all have to do it to bring him back. <laughs> all of you, <laughs> except for Mirko. Yes, well, Mirko had none. He keeps your, he tells stories in your tavern. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mirko. Well, 
Thank you, Chat, for giving uh, Mirko a second chance. Hey. Thank you. It has cost them gravely. The return. I think get all my spell slots back, right? A pleasure doing business to you. you and then he floats spell. by to Rahad right, and, and hands him the coins, which drop into his hand and oh. hands it over. Wait, he, wait. And then he what the F? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> the F? So you are back to half hit points. Woo! Um, Wizards. It is Fierk's turn. Fack. Fierk. <laughs> um, all right. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm still screwed. <laughs> okay. Um, can Grizz hand me a weapon? Is that a free action? On her turn. Mm. <laughs> Can I take it from Grizz? No. Like steal it from Grizz? No, I just just be like, I, I just need to bottle this real quick. Uh, um, I mean, I'll let you do that, but it'd be your action. Yeah, no, that's okay. Um, just I can use two, two weapons. If I use Onorike and my dagger, then oh. I can do two oh. fighting. But I'll give them to you next time. That's fine. Um, okay. I'm going to move up between those two dudes. <laughs> oh god. That are right in oh front god. of me. Gotcha. <laughs> and, <laughs> yeah. and uh I'm gonna take a uh I'm gonna take a swipe here. Um Yeah, I'm gonna take a swipe. Okay. At uh, the one to my right. As you hold your axe aloft, getting ready to strike. You feel another sense of ghastly energy gather around it. And just before you swing, something grabs the handle of it and stops you. And you look over and you see another dwarf there, a very stalwart looking fighter who really? nods his head. <laughs> it's good to see ya! Who are you? <laughs> well, I'm Reeve Cragholder! You don't look like Reeve Cragholder! Well, what do you know what I look like? What is. He's tall! What dwarves aren't tall? He's tall for a dwarf! You never seen me, there's legends and such! <coughs> well, it's all yeah. stories! Sure, but. Oh, you like to talk a lot, you're gonna fight or not? Well, yeah, I'm gonna fight! What, what are you doing here? Just fight! Okay! And you see his soul get absorbed into your axe. Oh, what the hell did you do? <coughs> for the rest of this encounter, because chat unlocked Cragholder's Might. Your weapon is a plus three magic weapon. Whoa! So thank you, Chad. Uh, yeah. So plus three. Cool. That's on damage and attacks. So nice. Thank you, Chad. They needed that. All right. I don't need you to sort of name one. <laughs> All right. Uh, dude to my right. Yeah. yeah. Dead. Um, <laughs> But I'm also uh, going to expend a superiority die okay. and do a sweeping attack. Oh, snap. And, oh, um, man. Let's see, I can only hit, there's only one other one I can get from this at this point, right? Currently. Within, within five feet of my original target. Okay. He, uh, uh, Rahadin is within five feet. You can move and do that. Did you use all your As movement? Well. Uh, I did not use all my movement. I moved two. Well, so of can... the original target, so you were already... Yeah. Oh, oh, I see. Yeah, so you don't necessarily I got have you. to. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's a creature within five feet of the original target and within my reach. So I would have to move to hit Rahadin. Okay. Um, but, uh... Yeah, I'm going to, um, just, just the dude right next to me then. Great. So, okay, go for um, it. if the original attack roll would hit the second creature... Oh, it also hits that one? It takes damage equal to the number you roll. It is three. dead. Yeah. That's soul... Disappears. Great. Two two lesser souls on the floor. Anything else from you? Uh. Wait, who did you hit? No, I'm gonna. This I'm guy. Gonna, yeah. So they're oh. di di diagonal. You can still move now. Yeah, I don't know if I want to be next to them though. Uh. So that's gonna be on their turn that you take that damage. Right. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll move up one, I guess. Okay. Anything else? Um, yeah. Uh -oh. Action surge. Okay. Oh. oh boy. This is it. Your action surge. 
Uh, I'm gonna try and hit Rahad in here. Okay. With your plus three weapon. Come on, baby. Baby. Ooh. That's a 16. Yeah. A 16 hits? Yes. Um, okay, and... Um, Roll dead. Oh, you're gonna use superior either? Um, yeah. Uh, I'm also gonna do a sweeping attack again. Oh, okay, yeah. You can hit uh, another one of those zombos. All right, so the one to his right. So that Great. zombie's gone, Great. and then I'll roll my damage dice. This one? Uh, yeah. To his right, or your right? To my right. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it takes damage equal to the number I roll on my superiority, but it doesn't matter who's dead. Um, and then... Yeah, I'm roll trying to see if I, if I add any more to, to the original mm -hmm. damage. Damage is on the same time. Okay. Uh, eight damage. That's one oh, plus wait, eight. Oh, wait, eleven. Great. What about the force damage, 1d6? <laughs> yeah, because it's a magic weapon. <laughs> Does that get no, added? not quite. Nah. Um, he takes a hit from you and says, Ah, dwarf, I should have killed you on that stage with everybody else. Ah, you couldn't. Ah, no. <laughs> yeah. I will end you soon enough. Um, no. That's the end of the round. There's one round left until the soul of Strahd appears. I'm gonna do one more thing. Oh, okay. Bonus action, uh, my second wind. Okay, do it. Yes! Hey, Ten. baby! That's a 13. Nice. Four more souls appear, looking for new bodies to inhabit. And don't yours look lovely? So you guys have one more round until the soul of Strahd appears. And Chet, you are, I believe, 22 away from the next tier, which would greatly help our players here. Um, just a mere 22. Mirko. Yes. You are returned from the dead after your friends <gasps> made a stalwart sacrifice Where to help I? you. you. Get are... up, goddammit! <laughs> <laughs> what you doing down there? Sorry, I'm not a bard. I don't know what to say. <laughs> It'll make him feel better. I'm not too good at it either. No, you're great. You're, you're so good at it. Anyway, we'll talk about it later. <laughs> I can't. Oh. Ah, yeah, yeah. That doesn't seem like a good idea. <laughs> Disengage? No, something else. Oh. Um. All right. Uh, uh so. Uh, Spellcasting in a uh, threatened square, does that provoke an attack of opportunity? No, it's or a disadvantage. I, I roll at a disadvantage? <coughs> yes. Because they can stop your somatic right. things from happening. Okay. Stop that. Stop that. Stop um, casting. <laughs> Quick it. No, come on. I'll, I'll, stop stop it. it. Quit it. No. I'm living. Come on, man. Don't kill me. Mm -hmm. Don't do that. All no, right. Well, let's do that then instead. Okay. What are you doing? <clears throat> oh, yeah, because I get one of these, too. Boop. Um, Mirko takes out his magic wand. He's nearly expended. He's seeing double. His eyes are rolling in the back of his head. But he sees well enough to point at this evil elf that has been tormenting him. And he does a little tiny movement. And uh, three missiles streak forth oh. uh, over the short expanse. And strike. Very nice. And strike Rahadan square in the chest for a whopping. Oh, oh, oh. Pretty good. Oh, oh, oh. Pretty good. Seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Whew. Twelve plus six is eighteen. Holy moly! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Your friends have wasted their time bringing you back. You will die soon enough. <sighs> Says Mirko. Gadget. Um, go, go, Gadget. Um, there's so many guys over there. I, I So these look like they're going to fall over pretty easily. The gates? Uh-huh. No. <laughs> they're stone. That's a weird thing to say. <laughs> I mean, they look weak, but not like you could push them over. They are gates. Really Stone have anything I can attack them with. Um, I guess I will just try and shoot 
Uh, I want to shoot that guy. The main guy? Yeah, Is that the main guy? That's oh, no, guy. then yeah. I want to shoot that guy. Okay, cool. Uh, 15. 15 hits? Mm-hmm. Nice. That one's dead. Okay. Anything else? Do you want to move? Um. Perhaps. Uh, yeah, this is, we have to get those portals on. Yeah. I, I will move, um, back over One, here. Two, okay. three, four, five? Yeah. Okay. Cool. You are there. Okay. Grace. Uh, so you... do you think both of the portals need to be up in order, or do you think we can just destroy one of them? Your guess is as good as ours. Is he coming? Mm-hmm. Did the way do, that we understood it was he coming through one of those portals or behind Damien? One of those. Oh, okay. Chris, as you are wandering behind the throne, what to do next? Uh, you feel a tap on your shoulder, and you turn around to see. Reeve Crackholder, sitting there. Don't think I forgot about you, lassie! Reeve! I, oh, this looks like a right mess. I, uh, uh, yeah, well, we're doing our best at holding up, up holding the Crackholder name. Uh, I, I can see that. I'm scared. Don't be scared. Believe in the might of the Crackholders! And he holds out his hand. And as he shakes your hand, you feel a surge of energy flow through you and you regain oh. all your spell slots. Wow! Whoa. Whoa. I want that! <laughs> Be a crag holder. You came back to life. <laughs> yeah. Human. <laughs> Human. Oh, Human. My precious spell slots. Um, I... Oh, spell slot. Okay, I, I'm gonna go here, right as close to the portal and the, those guys as I can get. One, two, three, four, five? Yes. Great, you are there. I'm gonna go there, and I am going to cast Thunderous Wave. Thunder Wave! Thunder Thunder Wave! wave. A thunderous force sweeps out. Each creature in a 15-foot cube must make a constitution saving throw. Wait. On a failed save, it it takes 2d8 thunder damage and is pushed 10 feet away. They they take half of their... Yeah, don't. half if it's not. So, um, but I also, I am hoping that it affects the portal. Okay. A bit too. Go for it. You so we make saves, right? If you want. What's that? You have all your spell slots back. Yeah. So we get level two thunder wave. And I'm doing it level two thunder wave. Okay. Um, so it is a 15 foot cube. You know it's not centered on you. You don't have to. It does, yeah, it doesn't have to be centered on right, me. Right. So I didn't um, know where you were gonna put it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna center it uh, on the the port. I'm gonna uh, the portal. Okay. Will it hit me? It won't hit me. Uh, it says each creature. In a fifteen. Wait, so oh, like, no, no, it says each creature in a fifteen. It says originating from you. It has to come out from you. Yeah, it has to come from me. Uh oh. Five, ten, fifteen. Oh. Well, you'll hit the portal and you'll hit that. Oh, but I'll hit yeah. you. No, you won't. No. Oh wait, I guess you will. You will. Uh, yeah. You will hit Reed. Uh oh. If you want, you could stand almost inside. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Let's Thank do you. That. Oh, wait, Thank you. Vampire 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 Vampire. Vampire. Oh, we needed this, Vampire um, Vampire. Do I have to? Thank you so much. Do I have to roll for this? That is a timely. Uh, no, it is a saving throw. And you're a good for person. us. Yeah. Constitution. Constitution saving throw, and then the Great. the portal can't really take a. <clears throat> no, the portal will be affected no matter what. Um, so roll damage for this, actually. Okay. Unless you roll one for damage, those zombies are annihilated. Uh. Remember, you get a bonus die because you're doing it at an extra oh, spell yeah. level. You get a plus, so three a plus d6 of force. Wow. Is that three ones? Ten. No, no, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, you get yeah, you add, add a d6. Uh, and a d6 of force damage oh. because of spell. Or force okay. damage because okay. of wizard. Yeah, oh, there it is, 16, baby. And then plus two spell attacks? Oh, that's for the attack, so you didn't make okay. a spell attack, but the so save 16. was 16. So these two souls are annihilated instantly, and you feel that gate above you crack and shudder. And it looks very much weakened by your attack. Nice. Uh, uh, so that's it's was, still standing. It that's is still, still standing, standing, but it, it does yeah. not look good. Can I have a Vosa? Vosa? Um, awesome, yeah. Um, I'm the flesh of Vosa, bitch. What can I do? Dark Vision. Uh, oh no. I don't think you can uh, do anything else. Bitch. Can I do an ice to honey? Bonus. <clears throat> bonus actions. 
Well, maybe a, a bard thing, but I don't. Ah, ah, ah. How's everybody's health? Not great. Not great. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> My health has been better. Yeah. Who is worse? You could say I am in poor health. I mean... Well, well I am far more threatened. <laughs> yes, he's yeah. got two less than me. At this yeah. Mirko! Yes? Stay alive, damn it! Very well. <laughs> One. Hey! Three. I'll take uh, it. I get three. And you, take, and you also take 1d6 force damage. Just kidding. Oh, Bastard. Geez. I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> JK. Scumbag. JK. JK, LOL. JK. Um, STS. Anything lol. else for you, Grizz? No, I. No. Okay. I wish. I don't think I have any other. I wish. I wish. Oh, God. All right. <laughs> um, hmm. I wish to go to the festival. Oh, he is really. So it is his turn. Bonus actions next time. And I'll need both of those. He still wants yeah. to kill Mirko because he's taunted him so much. <laughs> but also, you just you almost destroyed the gates. So he, I think he, he right. starts. Uh... Plus, Mirko has proved that he's immortal. So uh -huh. he has defeated death. He's laughed to death in the face. He got by. So what is the point? With a little help from his friends. This is true. Mirko no, owes you all a great debt. He's got to. He's got to hit Mirko. He's right next to him. It's up to you. When I am on my do crown do of bones, what? we will all share the rewards. Down. So, uh, you did drop those spells when you died. The what? The spells that you were concentrating on. Oh. oh well, uh, I don't think it's only concentration. I don't think uh, mage armor is concentration. It's not? It just so. stays up? Wait, hold on. Unless you go unconscious? That seems kind of weird. Let me well, look. Well, he did go unconscious. Right, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> because it, that would be eight hours of concentration. But, but While well, he's looking at us, let's do right. a cheers, everybody. Okay. 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 Vampire54, oh. toast. For the crack holders! For, for the, the crack, crack holders. holders! Cheers, thank you, Vampire54. Mm. Yeah, it is um, just an eight hour duration, um, not concentration. Oh. It would say concentration. But does it say it goes away if you go unconscious? A uh, spell ends if you're, if the target dons armor or if you dismiss the spell as an action. Huh, okay, great. Uh, protect the magic rounds until the spell ends. So, yeah. But I think spells end when you get a knocked unconscious. Well, the spell ends after eight hours. Oh, okay. That is the right. duration of the spell. Then I, then I guess you keep it. Ha 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 ha! Mirko It doesn't say otherwise, so I'll yeah. give it to you. <laughs> I believe um, it. Then, yeah, he's still going to attack you, though. I'm not afraid of you. Uh, it's a 20. Oh. Shield. Not a nat 20. Oh, but you have your sword, your shield up. Uh, yes. He has mage armor, but you no, can, as a reaction, cast shield. I can, as a reaction, cast a shield. And I guess I do. Okay, Since great. Uh, not my, my armor class is a 21. 21, okay. I need to do better than that. He makes a second swing at you. Uh-oh. Uh, he's going to reroll that. From the gold that your friends... Swing your have. little blade at me, yeah. man. Gone forever. Oh, dance your little dance. Wait, do I, I am you? not afraid of you, and I am not afraid to die. Maybe stop taunting him. <laughs> it is, uh, is Mirko's way. I mean his head. That's a miss as well. Third <laughs> attack. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. That's a good find. Thanks. Where'd he get that tie? Mm -hmm. Ooh! Ooh ho, ho, can we roll that as well? Oh. Why is Mirko so hard to kill? <laughs> right? Oh, that's oh, a seven. Yeah. That's Blarg. why Mirko is a tank. It's like lightning. Yeah, Mirko is a tank. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. Mm. This is called Survivability Mage. Um, it's a special build. Of my own devising. <laughs> you take three from the soul surrounding you. Psh! I have been dead. Um, I will not be dead again. It's Firk's turn. Firk. Firk, you mm. must take down the portal. And chat has unlocked tier six, <gasps> which oh, I will chat. get to in just a moment. Yay, chat! Chat's Killing it first. tonight. Around. So Firk, it's your turn. Uh. Oh, oh wait, sorry. One more thing. Make a wisdom saving throw. Oh, no. I will wretch your mind forever, Mirko. Ooh. Is that a, I can't tell what that is. 17. That is a 17, so Ooh. it's a 20. Uh, that is a pass. You take... <sighs> the voices don't scare me now. Three on a fail save. Okay. Hey. That's fine. <sighs> Psychic. Uh, now it's your turn, sorry. Mirko is fine. All right, so... If I try to move away, I'm going to take 
a couple of attacks of opportunity, right? Yes. But the, 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 those guys don't have attacks. They'll right? just they do just... one damage as you move away. As you move away? Yeah. Because oh. I'm not going to roll for them. They're just going to... They will yeah. try to swipe at you, but... The cantaloupe strive through? Oh, there's two portals. <laughs> my, but they might need my both. my concern. Well, this might make it a little easier. Uh, so, chat unlock tier six, which is... Another round, please, which means you guys get one more round oh, before the soul is drawn. Sweet. Oh, sweet. So this okay. will reset to two, and you will have one more round. This round is almost over, though. Right. Thank you, Chet, for that. They oh. very much need it. Very much. Ah. Mirko is a ninja. I can't believe we're still alive. Um. <laughs> Let's see. Did that. Did that. All right. Um, that, 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 and this, and this, and that here, and that. Am I better off trying to take these guys down, or try to just take, take, okay, I can take hits. I'm going to move towards the, uh, the portal. This one? Yep. Well, Great. if we have one more round, I can take them down. I can so you take one down. damage automatically. And the next one. You could also take the other one down. Uh, I get it! You rolled a dirty 20. Gadgets behind him. Dirty 20? A dirty 20? So okay. that hits. Yep. Uh, I guess I could healing word you too. Uh, ten slashing. Oh, dude. As a scimitar slashes your back as you walk away, and you took one from that, so you took eleven total from the. Okay. Oh, that's a, that's all right. Um, he good. He good. He good. Uh, okay. Oh, actually, yeah, I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine. Um, Everything's fine. Okay, so I'm gonna move up to this uh, thing and I'm just gonna go, all right! You know, the Knight World has never had a, a battle phase or anything like that, so I'm just gonna hit it <laughs> real hard. Uh, I'm gonna I'm, look for a weak point, maybe? Like maybe there was a crack that was made or something? Uh, what's the role you make for stone cunning? It's a history check. Do that. Should I move? <laughs> No, you're fine. <laughs> make Should sure, be fine. Make sure it falls the other uh, way. Need like a twelve on this. Oh yeah, baby! Uh, Bang! Double my my uh, so plus so twenty-two. Great. Uh, so I will give you 20, 20, 21, sorry. I will give you an extra d six of damage on oh. whatever your attack is. Great. Do I have to roll to hit an inanimate object? No, but you could crit. I didn't. You did. You, you got it too. <laughs> um, roll damage. Plus a d6. Oof. I'll get furked. Um, uh, let's see. Get furked? Get furked! Five. And it's plus eight, three for the magic uh, weapon. Right. Eleven. Eleven? This thing is barely being held together at this point. <gasps> Damn. Hmm. Actually, no, this would be here. Good swing, oh, Firk. Pensive. Uh, anything else for you, Firk? Um, no, I don't think so. Okay. Yeah, uh, that, nope, that's it. That's the end of the round, and this thing now resets to one as the portals sort of shut off for a moment, and you hear dark laughter in the castle, and Rahadin looks up like, dark powers are still taunting me. No matter, I will end this once and for all. You will all die in this room and Strat will be reborn. Um. <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how about no? Nah. You're kind of in the way. Nah. <laughs> no. <laughs> it is a, your no, turn. It's me. A miracle. No. <laughs> miracle. Yeah, it's deep shit. It's your turn. Well, obviously, I'm not getting out of this alive. But neither are you. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> What's happening? Uh, uh, the, the, uh, it sounds like a little clingy bell, uh, but in the eyes of Rahad, or sorry, in the ears of Rahadin, it's more like a boom, boom. And oh. he must make a save. Okay, what is it? Against... Your DC is 
Uh, 15. Thir oh yeah, 15, you're right, you're right. Not 20. <laughs> oh. Are you sure though? <laughs> you want to confirm? Can it just be different though? I rolled another nat 20, so. Oh, roll God. two 20s! <laughs> uh, I guess I confirmed it. He was just like, roll. Yep. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so Rahadin, uh, <laughs> instead of hearing a boom, he just hears like, ling, 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 ling. what is this <laughs> nuisance of a bell? <laughs> just as annoying as your voice, Miyako! Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> That's my turn. Does it do nothing? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh no. no. It does nothing. Miyako uh, has no spell slots left. Gajit? Okay. Damn it! Mirko was low oh, on power. Being it would have been cool if it had worked, though. A tinkerer. Ah. Can I, and, and dealing with putting devices together, can I do something to look at this and just find a spot where maybe if I stab it with my rapier, like between bricks and things like that, that could cause a weakness? I don't think the whole so, thing's gonna fall down. Like a death star I, I will give you the of. same check that he made, but at disadvantage, because you're not a dwarf. I'm not a dwarf. I have Tinkerer but and Artificer's a... Lore. Don't you have like explosives? It's not really a machine though. Wink. It's not really anything constructed out of. It's not magic no item. Explosive. I mean, it's magical, but it's not. Uh, what does it say? Uh, whenever I make an intelligence history check okay. related to magic items, I get twice my proficiency bonus. It's not an item per se. Okay. okay. Uh, so it'll be 12 per with se. disadvantage. So what am I. I'd say. What am I rolling? History now? with disadvantage. Where are you? I can't give the dwarf bonus to a non-dwarf. That'd be classist, racist, classist. Oh yeah. Oh, what's the other one? 20. It's a three. That tiny oh. one. I can never tell. Yeah. yeah are you sad. sure it's a three, or is it more like another twenty? It's. I wish okay. it's a three. So I got six. So no, you do not find any weakness that you can see. Your gnomish you eyes do not right. see <laughs> what the dwarven <laughs> eyes do. <laughs> it budges a little. I'm getting it. And then you realize it's actually you just pushing yourself I think backwards. I'm getting it, guys. <laughs> Do you want to still attack? I just I didn't make that oh, your action. Attack. Yeah, I didn't make that your action. Uh yeah, I'll just pop here and shoot that guy. In the back? Great. Yeah. Uh, maybe shoot the um that that guy. You think? Yes. I'm just afraid those other guys are gonna overwhelm. Can I shoot through the I, 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 I can't help it at this point. Then I'll shoot. But if we kill the bad, the bad guy, guy, perhaps something good will happen. Sure. Like everybody just magically disappears. Exactly. Uh, this is your last round before the soul of Strahd returns. Fifteen. Uh, fifteen hits. Meets. Yay! Uh, this would be sneak attack, right? Because he's got so many people, right? Around well, he him? has him, but he's also uh, occupied, so I don't think so. So no? I don't know how that's ruled. I don't either. It's completely different. I'll give you I'm one d6 of sneak attack. How about that? Sure. I'll meet in the middle. Eight plus two. Ten. 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 Nice. Yes. Uh, this Did is your you short bow, right? Force yes. Extra? <laughs> yes. No. A plus thirty force damage. So he gets shot in the back with a short bow arrow, and he plunges it out of his back and throws it to the ground, and looks at you through the portal and says, "You are not worth my blade, gnome." You're right. Just ignore me. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Okay. And kill your friends instead. Well, uh, Grizz. Uh, uh, can't you change the? The order? I can. Yeah. I, I, I it's at the start of combat. Oh, it's at the start. Um. I guess I'll let you change it now, if you want. But it, like, people who have already gone can't go again. Right. Change it to put. Just put me up in front yeah, of. Yeah, I can do that. Uh. You just ignore me. I'm gonna open my pocket watch and. What else does it do if not this? Out of combat, uh, out of combat it freezes time. It freezes time for 30 seconds. Oh, I don't know. Okay, so you pull out this magical. Uh, mm -hmm. You pull out this magic. Whoa, baby! Thank, 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 thank you so much! Thank you very much. 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 Thank you very Mm -hmm. And time stops. And now you can, can adjust uh, this order. So you are putting Ferk in front. You are also allowed to move Ferk anywhere you want. Oh. Ooh, yes. <laughs> what? So as time stops, you, you oh. look around and you walk over to Ferk and carry him, him to, him to <laughs> another location. I carry him. 
God, I wish everybody could see this. I'm being you real should. helpful right now. I should definitely get a job at the tavern. Where do you want I to should have a contract. What uh, if you put me next to Damien? To Damien? Uh, I I can. I think there's some horrid energy there that you have to deal with. Oh, oh. but you have to be strong to deal with it, and you are very strong. Okay. Yeah, put me next to Damien. Okay. Okay. All right, I'm going to go back over here now. Or you could just I'm chop, not, I'm not chop still his head within off. your cube, am I? From there? No, 15. No. No. Okay. I can do it again if I have And that for mm -hmm. after the 30 seconds pass, it falls apart in your hand, and time resumes to normal. Oh. I could have used that for other things. Um, what okay. the? Grizz, it's oh, your turn. <laughs> um, I'm going to do it. Well done. Hey. That was me. I'm Before gonna... you go, oh. um, one of these horrid souls flips you a, a haunted Barovian coin because Let's Grub 556 five, oh. gives a reroll to Grizz. Oh. Thank, oh. Thank, Thank you for that. Thank you. And chat has unlocked what? tier seven, Ooh. which what? I will do <coughs> immediately. Uh, also, we hit the main goal. Oh, wow. Whoa. We hit the what? We hit our goal for May. Oh, oh, awesome. Yay. Yay. Yeah. 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 Thank you, everybody. That's wow, awesome. You guys are so Very awesome. cool. Wow. Yeah. So, yeah. thank you, chat. Yeah, thank you, chat, for hitting that main goal. So. Chad has unlocked tier seven. Please. We're gonna resolve that immediately just before your turn. Okay. Standing tall, Rahadan pauses for a moment and looks at you, flourishing his blade, and says, Miserable peasants, you will all die by my blade, and then the dread lord will torture your souls for What is that? What is what? And he turns his head as if trying to listen to something very carefully, and then looks upward. And you follow his gaze, and then you see it. Fifty feet above you, from a large hole in the ceiling, you see a small object falling to the ground. It lands in front of Rahadin and lets out a small squeak as it hits the ground. A small, red-haired doll. <laughs> he picks it up and inspects it with confusion. <laughs> what is this? And then you hear, You no big doll! <laughs> as oh, yeah! Yeah! Rock Battle oh, Bands! <laughs> Join oh, the battle. Shit! Chat unlocked. Bumbles. For whom the troll tolls. Which yeah. are nice. yeah. Thank you, chat. Bumbles. Oh, Bumbles. Bumbles. Thank God you're here. Oh, that's so. This is so fun, guys. <laughs> so he appears immediately in front of Rahadi, and uh, uh, Zit is actually riding on on his back. And yes. because they joined Master this fight, Blaster style. Exactly. Because they joined this fight, inspiring you guys, you, heal, you each heal for 3 HP immediately. Ooh. 3 HP? Yay. As you're inspired by, hey, even a goblin and a troll I won't can die. be inspirational when the time is right. Thank you, Chet, for unlocking that tier. So cool. Um, <laughs> look, at, look at how much my hit points have changed. <laughs> yeah, man, this is ridiculous. It's a roller coaster. Look at, look at all the cross outs in the. Uh, we are 25 away from the final tier. Can you see that? Okay, Grizz, it is now your turn. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, it's that one. Is that oh, one? That, we have that one that too. This one too. Okay. That's I am so going weird. to cast okay. Thunder Wave you again. Okay. Ridiculous. Um, All right. I don't know. Death by a thousand. If cuts. I should do second tier, you think I should just go for second tier? He, he said it's on his last legs. It's looking but do rough. you want to risk it? Get, just get the extra. Just take yeah, the extra. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What are you worried about? We're going to have to fight Stroud or something? <laughs> like, Yikes. See? Add a d6. Oh. Add a d6. Yeah. Wow. Wow, wow. minimum damage! Oh. Was it all ones? Six. No, it was. Pretty much. Pretty much. Essentially. Six? Are you kidding me? No. This thing is. Literally, someone could touch it and it'll fall over. I touch it. <laughs> it does not fall over. Uh, <laughs> but you said literally. Wait, but the other two die. Oh yeah, they're 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 gone. Demolished. Um, yeah, it is. Wow. <laughs> um. Uh, we are. Can, can her move action be to push it? <laughs> yeah, I have a whole move. I've I. Have. Uh, if you <laughs> if you ram into it using your move action and take one hit point of damage, I will give it to you. Done. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah. So you use all your strength after hitting this thing with a thunder wave, <laughs> and it doesn't fall. You're like, come on! And then you <laughs> just charge at it. <laughs> Collapse against it and exhaust. 
exhaustion. <laughs> I imagine I imagine you just Fonzie it. You just like. <laughs> exactly. That too. Yeah. Um, and this thing crumbles to the ground. Nice. Destroyed. Yay! Good work. Yay. And the the planner energy wavers for a moment, but the other portal is still going, and you still have to bring it down if you want this to. I end. got it. Uh, Do you? This does Come add here. this does add a counter to this though. So you have cool. one, you've earned yourselves one extra round. Nice. All oh, right. Oh. I will be dead for that. Thing. It's all right. She's still got like 990 <laughs> ball there. bearings to take this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that was your turn. Anything else? Um, you use your movement to I use make my movement, yeah. So you're I'm, there. I'm good. Firk. Yes. You are now uh, in that location. Suddenly, you just appeared there. Yeah. Time stop for a moment and you just, you're yeah. here. Boop. Boop. Hold on, I'll, I'm uh, going to get you out of here. Uh, make a strength saving throw. Sure. Uh, that's a 18. Yeah, 18 baby. is exactly what you needed. Nice. Uh, so you resist uh-huh. this pushing force of uh, energy that comes towards you, but you still take a little damage. You take. <laughs> Uh, six points of damage. All right. You okay? Yeah. But you are still there. Get you on your tough yeah. guy. Mr. Um, Craigholder, Mr. Craigholder, please save me. Uh, stay very still, and um, I'm just gonna try and chop the chain okay. off. Okay. He has he has four of them, one on each limb. But yeah, go for it. Okay. Uh, that's a twenty, a dirty twenty. Dirty twenty. That hits. Great. Uh. No damage roll necessary, you cut off one of those changed. Awesome. Gone. Cool. Anything else for you? Uh, nope, that's it. Okay. That's all I can do. Um, it's Rahadin's turn. Unless I can use a sweeping attack to, it, to hit another one. To use a support, superiority die? Yeah. Uh, if you want, I'll allow it. Okay. Um, it, it's, uh, I don't know. Oh, it just happens. It just happens, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah. So you do one of his legs as well. Cool. So one leg, one arm free. Uh, it is now Rahadan's turn, and him seeing you trying to free Damien uh, enrages him, and so he's gonna misty step no. his last one uh, to here. Damn. Uh, How dare you! How dare you! Um, <laughs> let's see. He is going to attack you three times. I'd like to see him try. That is a 22. Okay, he tried very well. It's like, I'm watching a movie, but I'm in it. You take 11 points of damage. Great. Still up! Still up! Amazing. Uh, 16, which is your AC. Yep. Oh man, I think this is gonna be it. Curtains. Uh, You take nine points of damage. Still up. Damn! Last one. Survive this and you're all right. Uh, that is a 14. Yay! But I have so many haunted, haunted Barovia. Ah! It'd be silly not to use them at this point. Uh, that is an 18. Fuck. Yeah. Funny fuck. Are you down? Uh, that is a... Uh, 13. Yeah. That's a negative... <laughs> 11. No! So you are oh, cut no. down as Rahada misty steps in front of you and just slashes... Um... There are no spirits coming yeah. to save you this time. You are unconscious and dying. It is Zombo's turn. Can I heal you? I can't heal I think you can. So they. The max is five and six for me. They like you oh, so much. It's, it's, I'm, I'm just at zero. I'm not at negative. Oh, yeah, he's at zero. Okay. <laughs> yeah. uh, so, Mirko, you take yes. five. Yes! And uh, <laughs> drain me, you filthy <laughs> demons. Zit and Bumbles take two. Oh, yeah. But they are gonna. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay, you're next. Okay. Uh, now it is once again the final round. You have one round until the soul of Strahd appears. Guys, just give him all of your candles and stuff, and I'll. I'll, I'll... <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we work. brought back Mirko. <laughs> hey, Mirko's doing work. There are no more deals to be made. 
This is the end, one way or the other. Oh. Oh wait, nope, nothing appears on that side. <laughs> that gate no longer exists. Okay, Mirko. Yes. What was I saying? It was, I don't remember. I have, oh yes, that's right. <gasps> Like this. <laughs> it's a 17 plus stuff. <laughs> Mirko is so useless without his spell slaps. Yeah, that tends to happen. But you, you get a plus two. I know, it's yeah. not enough. Okay. He's not enough. Damn it! Anything else? No! <laughs> I'm sorry! Sometimes it's just how dice roll, man. Wait, can I, uh, I can move, it's, though, yes? It's only three points of damage. Right. Um, uh, and you'd be five if he moves away from all of them. Oh, yeah. He would take three from them, and then, I don't know, I don't know where he's going, actually. Oh, there's another one, I see, behind Bob. Um, yeah. Out of my face. Uh, there's a lot of dudes around, isn't there? Okay, so um, if I do this, that's three. Did you take three? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't go over there though. Um, it just smell like steel. No, I know. Oh, good. Could I hold this? Yeah. They can fight and not. Yeah, it doesn't. Four. It doesn't sink to water. They just smell like steel. Five. Five. Six. Leather. Leather. Yeah. Sorry, five. Okay. One, two, three. Wait, isn't that, how many movement was that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, perfect. Yeah, okay. So you just take five. Yeah. How much do you have left? Two! <laughs> okay, uh, is that any, anything else for you? Is that it? Uh, no, no, I, 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 I brace myself against the column, but okay. I can't do anything to it. You uh, feel that column shaking as the entire uh, castle and earth below you is just quivering with the soul of Strahd approaching. I'm doing it! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, oh, Zit on top of Bumble says, what, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? What do we do? Kill the elf! Kill the elf! Kill the elf! Uh, wait, Mirko's telling me to kill an elf. Is that I do that? He's kind of uh, anti-elf, you know. I just want to make sure. Oh, no, this elf is okay to kill. This elf's bad! Okay, here we go! Um, so, uh, Bumbles is going to go up here. And um. Bumbles Bye. and Zit. Actually, I guess Zit's going to attack from far away first. He's going to, he has a short bow. Uh, chat, we might go long tonight. Maybe a little bit. Oh, that's a natty one. Mm, is so it? That, that, that bow. Oh, goblin He's... luck. Goblin luck? Yeah. Uh, but he, uh, Bumbles does a clomber over to uh, Rahad and, and makes uh, two attacks. One Bumbles. with a bite Smash. and one with a claw. <laughs> a nine plus five is one off. So that does oh. not hit. That does hit. Yay. That is his claw. claw. Yeah. Which is. Uh. 12 slashing damage. Damn. Holy damn. For control. God. Uh, but now he needs to make a strength saving throw and not get pu pushed back. Uh, he's probably pretty strong, right? The strongest. But he fails by one. It is a very powerful oh, spell. Oh no! So he gets pushed to here. Oh, he didn't make it save? No, but he did get a good hit in. I guess I should have done it before, but... Cool. He takes eight points of damage. Oh, how are you gonna get that? Okay. Uh, it is now Gadget's turn. This might be your last turn. Take it down, Gadget. I don't think I can do anything to that. Um, and kill the start, elf. You can certainly yeah. hit it. Or, yeah, you can always attack the elf. Yeah, uh, I'll step right here and shoot at the elf. Okay. Right between his eyes. Oh, that's a, a uh, nine. A nine's a miss. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Gosh, this. Step moving. Anything else from you? I will step back over here. <laughs> okay, Chris, your turn. Oh, I don't, I can't make it to the other 
Well, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna cast Tasha's hideous laughter on Rah Rahadin. Okay, what is that? You mean? have to um if you have I'm guessing your intelligence score is more than five. Correct! <laughs> um Ow, it's salting. Are you triggered by damage? Is that I don't Hmm? It says target has advantage on the saving throw if it's triggered by damage. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means either. Uh, but basically, it you have to succeed a wisdom saving throw. Okay. Uh, wisdom, I rolled a 15. Your save is? 12, I think. 12 plus 2, 14. so 14. No! One point. One point. Oh, Great job. Thank you hey. for 25. Hey. Wow. Thank All you right. Guys. Chad has unlocked with that the final tier, oh, which yay. is called. Be something good. There must always be a dread lord. Oh no, that doesn't sound good at all. Thanks, Chad, yeah, for unlocking that. Good. What does that mean? Uh, You'll see. Okay. Um. So. Cool. I'm gonna. Oh. That. It's that's the the ongoing. So if if there is damage and he, and he makes a saving throw, then okay. it's a damage. I see. But that's only if he fails his initial save. So uh -huh. that's for okay. those of you keeping score at home. So he takes half damage. Or um, no, no. Oh, nothing. The, the, the spell fails. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it fails. Because if it succeeded, you would have gone. You would have thrown. Yes. Amazing. Anything saving else? Throws. Um. I've just been rolling really well for for yeah, that. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Do you need a heals? Do you... I mean, I'm dead. You're dead? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if okay. you, I mean, if you want Bark. to try to heal me. Yeah. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Four! Four! That's four hit points? Yeah. I'm back. You regain I'm back, baby! <laughs> you are so prone. Sure. In the best way. You are so prone, and you are still on that rune. Anything else, Chris? I needed Reef to come now, not then. <laughs> um, all right, fair. It's all up to you. There is a pretty good chance you can end this. But first, make a strength saving throw. Come on, Ferk. Roll good. That's a... Probably not good enough. That's a 15. Oh! A 15 Damn it. is a failure. So. Can you throw something at it? <laughs> your body is hurled three squares away, and you take a bit of damage. Wait, but Bumbles didn't take damage. He did. He did? Yeah. Hmm. Uh, I took damage. I just thought, because I'm a crag holder, I shouldn't. You know. <laughs> Ready? Eight damage on my You only take three. I'm still up, baby. Oh wow! <laughs> Very lucky, but can that's... you still get him with your crossbow? Minus three. Mm-hmm. I can. Uh. How does Rahadin look? Pretty bad. He is in. Uh. He's well past bloody. You want to give whatever this is going to be your all. <laughs> he's just like, this is one hit point. Can I, can I move back? So this standing takes up half your movement. Oh yeah. So now you have, I'm going to say it's rounded up. Okay. So you can get back there. You have to roll again, though? But you will have to make another strength saving throw to not get hurled back by the oh, spell. God. If you don't hit, make it, you will take damage. Yes. Oh, God. So, we are at a point of save or die. Save or I kill Damien. Or, or you kill Damien. What? Well, you have to make the save first. Well, but I then... could shoot him with my crossbow and not go up there. Oh, sure. Sure, but... you could also try that. Well, don't shoot Damien, then. Shoot. It's certainly an option. But Rahadin is not doing anything. 
the Dreadlord will come whether Rahadim is alive or not. Do we know this? I, I, mean, I assume. I, assume. I, think, I, think. I mean, he's, it's not like he's actively chanting anything to bring him back. Mm-hmm. But. <sighs> All right. Oh, God. But how, like, how much could you, like, how much damage could you do to Damien? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm running up there. You're gonna run oh. up there, axe drawn, towards Rahadin. Or Damien. What do you got to roll here? Towards them. Well, I got to... This is the strength saving throw. Yeah. Oh, that's <gasps> good. Yes. That's an 18. That's an 18. <laughs> you get there. All right. Oh. You are there. Hey, man. You got to kill a kid. You got to kill a kid. So, on, on a successful like save, a you do take kill. damage. Oh, shit. But I, <laughs> I will forego it because this is rule of cool. This is a very cool <laughs> last moment. I get... I could cut Damien loose. Mm-hmm. I could try and kill Rahadin, or I could kill Damien. Yeah. Yeah. All three of those things. You hear the voice of Reeve Crackholder coming from the blade of your axe. What are you doing? You can't kill a boy. Uh, he raises his axe. Um, and... Which way are you going? He's going to cut Damien loose. You're going to cut Damien loose. Yes. What's All right. Kill me off. So, I'm going to say trying to do this next to Rahadin is going to be at disadvantage because he is oh. actively in front of you. Then I'm going to fuck Rahadin up. Yes. Okay. Uh, all right. Shit. Uh oh. No. Well, wait. That's. Does anybody have a reroll? It is a plus three weapon. I know. That's a. That's 14. You need a 15. Damn it! That's it, huh? Does anybody have a reroll? No. Oh! Well, you do. Yeah. Oh. That's a reroll. All right. One haunted Barovian coin. This is likely your last chance. Oh, God. No pressure. It's just up to the die. Yeah. That's a 16. Yeah. 16 hit. <laughs> that is enough. That is enough to hit Rahadi. All right. Roll some damage, baby. That's uh, 9, 12. 12. 12 damage. And. Uh oh. I'm going to expend my last superiority die. Yeah, you probably should. <laughs> um, uh, and I'm doing a uh, disarming attack. No, wait. No, I'll do a trip attack. Okay. Yeah, trip attack. So I hit him. Okay, hold on a second. Does this do more damage? Yes. You need six more damage. Okay, it does. Potentially eight. Okay. <laughs> Six <is>? more. <laughs> Two, eight. Unless I can add the three to the superiority damage die. No. I believe it's just that straight damage. Oh. What about the four six? <laughs> Stop <those>? that. <laughs> yeah. Oops. That's, that's a two. Even if you added the three, it would have been a five. Yeah. But no, no force damage? No. <laughs> no force damage. Uh. Okay. All right. All right. But uh, oh. that was a trip attack, right? Yes. So uh, he he has to roll oh, a sure. strength saving throw. Great. Uh, strength, you said? Mm-hmm. Strength isn't terrible, but it's not great either. It is 12. Um... DC equals eight plus twelve. Ah! Ghost tack, thank you for the sub. Oh, thank you. All right, thank you for the sub. Uh, that's a fifteen he needs to make. Plus two. He's gonna reroll it. Plus two. It's not a spell. He rolled a fifteen plus. Oh something. damn it! All this gold, that folks. Second roll was pretty good. All that Barovian gold. Is DC only for spells? Does it do any more damage if you had tripped him, or is it just for a trip? He just gets knocked prone. Okay. All right. So, 
Is that the end of your turn? Um... I didn't have a short rest while I was dead, did I? <laughs> no. No. Yeah. No, you didn't. Is there a question? No. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, unless... Uh, yeah, it I, is, can't use my, I can't use my dagger. It is his turn. Um, he is on his last legs. No joke, he has two HP. Like, that is how close you were <laughs> for each leg. <laughs> this close. Damn it. And he flourishes his scimitar and looks at you as like, you lose, and tries to attack you. That's a nat 20. He hits his own face. So, and, flourishing his blade, uh -huh. he decapitates you. Yeah. Oh. No. <laughs> as your head goes flying through the chamber oh, oh, oh. into dead silence. Oh, but he can't even say. Uh, did he have a vorpal blade? No. It was just a really cool thing to do. Can you roll for that? <laughs> so, as you all stare in horror, as uh, Fur cra <laughs> Cragholder's head flies right. through this chamber. Arterial and hits, blood spurting. It lands uh, directly on the throne, the seat of the throne. Oh, nice shot. Um, you see the portal oh, erupt God. with planar energy. And you see a very imposing figure exiting the gate. Dressed in dark attire with a flowing blood red cape, the shimmering soul of Strahd von Zarevic walks out of the threshold. He looks down at your body, bleeding and dying, and smiles with delight. Oh, I'm not dead yet? Well, I guess super, <laughs> super dying. Yeah, depends on, I mean, you know, there's theories that the body, that the head lives on after it's mm -hmm. decapitated, so, you know. He looks, he looks yeah. out over to Rahadin and gives him a short bow. And then turning towards Damien, he begins approaching the young man. And when he reaches him, he says, my rule begins anew. And with that, you hear Damien scream in pain as his body absorbs the soul of Strahd, and there's a blinding flash of light. And when the light fades and you regain your vision, you look up in horror to see Damien standing in front of you, a devilish smile on his lips. Ew. Uh. Ew, dear. And he says, you have lost, for I, Strahd von Zerovic, have returned. But I am a merciful lord. You showed great resolve in trying to stop this event, and for that, I will leave you with your lives, if you so choose. And he looks at you and waits. What, what's the alternative besides our lives? What's the other choice? Just to die? It is death. Certain death. It or, I suppose you could choose to fight me, Lord of Ravenloft. <laughs> Mir Mirko takes a knee. Most gracious Lord of Ravenloft. Welcome back to Barovia. Interesting. Well, I could always use a new servant. Firk also takes a knee, but it's because he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> my dear lord, I would gladly pledge my magics to your, to restore your greatness to this realm. Rahadin, what do we think of this peasant? And Rahadin looks over to you and then looks back at Strahd and says, And he looks back at you. Hmm. You can join me in death, and I will bring you back. Any of you wish to make a deal? Uh, no, I think we'll go. I think we're good. We got this whole tavern to take care of, right? We're gonna go and take care of the tavern and, you know, figure out what the next step is after that, right? What about my cousin, brother? Who? Will you bring him back? Broken. Him. Oh. And him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe so, no. If he fell to Rahadin, 
He is not worth my time. That's really rude to say about uh, Rahatan, right? Rahatan, that was rude. He said something. We should go. We should leave. Bumbles and Zid at this point are like, I, 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 oh, yeah, we're, we're gone. We're gone. <laughs> and they start marching out. Can I stealthily try to cast Tasha's hideous laughter on Rahatan? Yes. <laughs> stealthily. Make a stealth check. <laughs> Just... Um, That's pretty good. Dirty 20. I'm gonna give him disadvantage because he is bowing to Strahd currently. Uh, ooh, oh. That would've been a 20. Yeah. Uh, he does not notice you casting a spell. Um, okay. Let's so see if Strahd I, notices I though. cast it. Oh man. Yeah, he defo notices. <laughs> I don't think I need to add his bonus, but I'm sure. Let's see, Strahd's <laughs> bonus for perception is plus 12. <laughs> So that is a 28. Wow. And so uh, as he sees you raise your hands to cast a spell, he disappears from his spot in an explosion of flying bats and reappears in front of you in full garish armor. Wow. And says, I gave you mercy. And you dared raise your hand. <laughs> Did you leave, or are you still here? Uh, well, I was trying to get her to go with me, but it kind of depends on what happens next. <sighs> <sighs> Ungrateful peasants. So be it. Prepare to die. Okay. Mirko runs. <laughs> yes, yeah, I will also run. Roll initiative, and we'll see if you make oh, it okay. Get out of here! I'm oh, that's not good. I'm a drag holder, and I'll die fighting for Things. Oh, I got a six. Yeah. Fifteen. Mm-hmm. Okay. This did not go well. Oof. Uh, oh boy. One, his two, initiative one. can't be that high. Yeah. <laughs> really? Well, it's only his dex. He doesn't have a. Oh, that's true. Initiative. Yeah. Thing. So. What does that say? Eighteen. Okay. So twenty-one. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty What'd good. you roll? Gadget? Should have kept that watch, I guess. I rolled an eight. Okay, gadget. Yeah, right. Uh, six. Yeah, that watch would have been really helpful here. <laughs> Grizz? New watch? Roll for initiative? Oh, 15. Okay. So. China. <laughs> um, you are right in front of him, so he's going to attack you immediately. I did not think I was going to use the stat block today. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Take a fatigue. So that is a 17. He has to take a fatigue. That's oh. where maybe more work than he thought he was going to do. I'm just going to use the. You're at a minus uh, one. You take yeah. eight bludgeoning, 14 necrotic. So that's just 22. Just, just 22. 22 hit points. You're still. You're fine, right? Mm-hmm. Look at that. <laughs> you took you took a whack from Cha uh, from Strahd, and then he makes a bite attack, and you just oh. took it on the chin. That's only a twelve. I'm dead. Oh, that no. hit a is three it, plus a nine. Hit? Oh, oh, hit. Yeah. Oh, your AC is twelve. Twelve. My AC is twelve. He rolled a three and still hit. <laughs> That's Strahd for you. Uh-huh. Uh huh. So you are bit, uh, and you take seven piercing and ten necrotic. That's it. I, yeah. I, I'm, that's all she wrote. Good night, folks. You're dead. <laughs> uh, the drum has stopped for the crag. Grizz, time. you are dead. Mirko, what will you do? Mirko runs. Okay. And as he runs, he says, Lord Strahd, I graciously accept your offer for leniency. You get to here okay. with a dash. That's what you want, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, end of your turn, he gets a legendary action. So he gets to move his speed which is 30. You will know that I did not attack you, nor did I attack any of your lieutenants. He gets to here, and then... I know you are a man of your word. It is Gadget's turn. <laughs> so what's in this room? Are there windows? Uh, there are windows, but they are like uh, like 10 feet off the ground. Oh, I can Stained glass windows. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay. I'm going to head for the window and try and break it and go Okay, where are you? Oh, you're right next to here, great. <laughs> yeah. I'll let you climb up to here, uh-huh. uh, and 
Just make an attack roll against a stained glass window. Uh, what do I add? Just proficiency? Just your, whatever weapon you're using. Oh, uh... uh your rapier, I, just I'll to start. I'll probably use the butt of my rapier, so. Okay. Uh, that is... <laughs> so Useless tiny! Useless dice! Useless! <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> tiny. Uh, <laughs> that's a third, uh, 17 total. 17 hits. Yeah. Okay. You just need five points of damage to break okay. a window. Wait, this is not the right character. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> that's Ava. Oh! Um... Why haven't you been using Ava this whole time? <laughs> yeah. oh, silly. Uh, can I sneak attack the window? <laughs> hey, hey, I got hey. eight plus four. So the window shatters and you jump out, making your escape. You are gone. <laughs> End of your turn. He gets another legendary action. Gets to you. It is now his turn. Okay. Uh, -oh. uh <laughs> should have taken the window. <laughs> Lord Strahd, I beg for mercy. Please, Lord Strahd, make I will a, serve you with every ounce of my being. Make a persuasion. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Straight up persuasion. <laughs> Eighteen. 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 Suck it, Strahd. Oh. Oh. You got a ten. Plus eighty. No, it's plus four. Oh. 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 So. No, but he has a reroll. <laughs> no, oh. I'm a bitch. <laughs> I have so many. There's back no here. guarantees here. Oh, uh, that is a. Uh, 17? 17. Less than an 18. Less than an 18. Wow. So he Minico stops. throws himself to the ground. He stops with his blade held high. <clears throat> my lord, I will serve you with every fiber of my being. And then my he, essence is yours to command. He grabs you by the throat. <laughs> uh, oof. Damn, I just saw this reroll. Hmm? Never mind. It's a little late. It's too late. I'm sorry, Ghost Hack. Uh, he grabs you oh. by the throat, brings you close, and bites you at, at the neck. Oh, God. Uh, and you feel you s slowly lose control of your body. Uh, yeah. You will serve I me very as a quickly lose control. You will serve me as a spawn until the day you perish into ash. No, and then sucks. throws you on the ground, and you feel your body just seize and shiver and change slowly. Oh, this is what it feels like. It's chew, not so pleasant. To chew five gum. <laughs> <laughs> um, Bumbles and Zit escape out the same window you did. Or actually, they must have, they probably ran out the door a long time ago. Um, <laughs> so, your visions, except for yours, go to white. And what seems like moments later, the two of you find yourselves just outside the castle, near the front door. You pick yourselves up off the ground, and the wind stirs around you, but otherwise, the night is pretty quiet. Well, uh, <laughs> that, was a, that was a thing, so I think we go in and... The lemon cheesecake's pretty good. Yeah. That was... I might uh, have one of the healing potion Things. So you approach the front door, and you see that halfling, and at this point you can't see through him. He seems whole and real to you. And he says, mm, back so soon. I think we're on the list this time. <laughs> I see your customer service skills haven't changed. Well, why would Douchebag. <laughs> why would they? Yes. What's a douchebag? <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Trust me on this. It's a Daggerford thing. So, I suppose you have a choice at this point. You could wander out in the world and become one of those hateful things, or you can accept your fate and walk through here and have your final meal and move on to the great beyond. Whatever it is, we're doing it together. Crag holders stick together. Can we be good ghosts? Can we just run the tavern and be friendly? Do we have to be hateful? Unlikely. <laughs> All right. Your table is ready. And we'll walk through the door. You both walk through the door. And as you do, <laughs> you see pulses of dark magic begin flowing throughout the castle as it slowly begins rebuilding itself. Brick by brick, slowly and surely, Castle Ravenloft is returning to its former glory. 
The mists of Barovia shroud the land once more, and a dark figure smiles atop his rooftop castle. For on this night, and for every coming night in the near future, it will always be cloudy in Barovia. The end. That's the show, everybody. <laughs> That's the show. Right. I tried to tell him. <laughs> I tried. I tried. <laughs> but well, I got a tavern now, so. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> oh, that is also true. <laughs> uh, although I think Mirko might come back to tell a story. Yes. We'll see. I got a couple extra flips up my sleeve. Oh, God, my hand fell off. Yeah. <laughs> So, everybody, thank you so much for watching. That was thank an you. excellent yes, final you. session. What was that reroll for? Uh, it was for anybody who was dying, but this was done after, I believe. Technically, it was for Dom, but it was literally seconds before you decapitated. Oh. Uh, they switched it to Jesse, but then. Uh, <laughs> well, uh, hey. I guess we need to engage that low latency option, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Gadget's alive, so what more can you ask for? Yeah. Well, Soul Survivor. Go, go, go. That was going to be Mirko. I was wrong. Oh, you're, you're alive in a way. I, Makes I, sense. I, I, you get to live as a vampire I, spawn in a very I mean, nice castle. Gadget's gonna be there. There are worse things to that, take down Strath. You guys were so close. You were just that close. But I could, advantage. If I had killed Rahadin, would that have done anything? That would have ended it. Yeah, because basically he would have dropped the heartstone that he was holding, uh, and that would have ended the spell. You could have cut Damien and ran. God, two that, damn hit points were, away. Yeah, I kid you not. You were this close, and I. If either of my spells had hit. If, uh, yeah, mine, both of mine. Well, what was his, um... What if I had his... just left you for dead, like I wanted to. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, we gotta end this, because we did go long. Thank oh, yeah. you guys for oh, sticking around. Thank you so much for all your long. tips. You made it through all the tears, and these guys appreciate it. Even the most of them didn't survive. No, it was, that was awesome. Um, that was fun. I've never been killed before in games. Really? Really? Yeah. I know, I'm a little, like, I'm like, oh, oh, uh, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Grown oh. accustomed to her face. Um, and the music, like... Yeah. Oh. So... It's very lost ending. My my right. wonderful players, where can they find you next? Uh, starting okay. with Dom. Uh, you can find me on Friday uh, for a episode two of Wild Cards, uh, the Weird West Deadlands Reloaded show that we do with uh, lots of awesome people, but Gaurav and Megan are also in that, along with Jordan Pridgen and Jordan Caves Kellerman as the Marshal. So come back on Friday. Yeah. It's good stuff. Maybe. Yes. You should watch. Okay. 8 o'clock Pacific time. Next. I'm Jesse Hendricks. Uh, next, uh, so every Tuesday night I do a D and D stream with the Merry Mercenaries on Twitch and. Um, I don't know, uh, Everyday Science on YouTube. I do Element a Day in May, every May, and science parody videos. Every day of every May. Every right? day. Every day, every May. Every May. It's May. madness. So lots of videos, uh, if you like science-y stuff. Um, and then, yeah, I don't know. I'll be home, like, kind of, like, stopping in a corner. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, hey, <laughs> it's good. It's a cathartic experience it's good. to yes. have a character killed, man. Yeah. You're, you're still very new shoes. to uh, uh, the role-playing games, I right? I am. Yes. I am hooked, though, now. And I'm you guys glad. are actually, like, really the first that kind of brought me into to that. Oh, that's, that's awesome. Really cool. That's so cool. Yeah. yeah. I had no idea what I was doing, and now I, like, Sort of know what I'm doing. You're doing great. <laughs> like, yeah. You're doing great. I think you guys had a great ending. You two standing hand in hand together, I, walking I through those doors. I couldn't walk out of there like with, and yeah. just leave him. There. Yeah. There's no Craig Holder wouldn't do that. Yeah. 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 Um, gadget would. <laughs> speaking of gadget, gadget, where can they find you? Megan? Uh, you can find me on Twitter <laughs> at Megan Caves, M E G H A N. Uh, uh, and uh, you can find me, yes, on Wild Cards this Friday. You can also see our cool intro that Garab here edited. We updated it. It's so, it. so cool. cool. It's Thanks, up on guys. our YouTube, and so cool. it's up on our social media right now on uh, Saving Throws Twitter and Facebook, so check that out if you missed it. Uh, or, you know, watch us on Friday, and you'll see it there. Um, yeah, and then you can find me, Garav, and Jordan Caves Kellerman on our podcast, Experience Pointers, where we talk about RPG stuff and GM stuff. And actually, pretty soon, Tyler is going to be guesting on it. Not Hi, the episode that's on right now, the next one. Yeah. So check Mom that out. And yeah. you can find us on Twitter at EXP Pointers Pod. I think that's everything. Yeah, I can't keep track of my own brain, yeah. so. Yeah. That's it! Okay, yeah. it's next we have. Exhausting yeah. night. Hi, guys. Uh, you can follow me on the social medias at uh, Boring Old Tyler. 
All one word. Boring gold. No hyphens or yeah. underscores. Boring gold, Tyler. Boring, boring gold, Tyler. You're a big mining fan. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Exactly. I have lots of tweets oh. about mining. Boring gold. Boring gold. <laughs> boring gold. <laughs> Various technologies. I'm up to date on it. Um, yes, and I may have something uh, coming out for Starfinder or not Starfinder. Sorry, uh, for Saving Throw, uh, possibly at the end of the month. Uh, so keep Whoa. your eyes and ears peeled. There could be great things coming from Mr. Tyler Rhodes, but you'll have to wait and see. Okay. Until it is formally announced. Cool. <laughs> if um, it is formally announced. Never. So, Just show up. thank you very much for watching, Barry. Thank you so much to the mods who keep our channel awesome, friendly, safe, and clean. Uh, thank you so much to Tyler Boyce for doing an amazing job. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, also, I want to uh, give a special thanks to the Curse of Straw Discord channel, where I shared some of my ideas, and they gave me some really good feedback on how to make 100 years post straw a really cool thing. So thank you so much. Uh, I will probably link that on my Twitter so you guys can join and get a bunch of cool ideas yourself. Um, you can share the hashtag AlwaysCloudyRPG uh, if you want to talk about the show. Thank you for the people that did. You became NPCs. I hope you enjoyed your interpretations that I did. Um, and if you like the tavern set that we had on display earlier, visit epic-forge.com to get one of your own. It's 10% off using the code ALWAYSCLOUDYRPG. Um, and the next thing we have on the channel is wild cards. So, like they said, Wednesday, 8 p.m. Pacific time, wild cards. And, uh, we're gonna sign off real quick, but before we do, we did unlock the final tier called There Must Always Be a Dreadlord. And so, let's do that. We are going to sing the Cheers theme song Aww. in a very happy and uplifting way. Perfect. That name was just to trick you guys into thinking something bad was going to happen. But it happened anyway, so no big deal. So, <clears throat> I don't know this. Oh, at this all. is just all the. This is just the original. I'll be gadget. Yeah, this is. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You guys ready? Yeah. Do you guys know the words? Nope. Yeah. I, I, okay. I, I don't even need to look at the words. Great. I don't, I don't have. I didn't. I didn't print the words out for myself, so I can't sing it. Good luck. This is one of my favorite Here we go. Shows. I, mm, it's still a really mm, good show, actually. Okay. Mm, mm, Making may a way in the world whoa, whoa, today. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take, I'm gonna play the music too. Oh. oh. Okay. You have the karaoke version? Yeah, I do. No. Oh, nice. Making your way in the world today takes everything you've got. Taking a break from all your worries sure would help a lot. Wouldn't you like to get away? Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. And they're always glad you came. This is brought to you oh, by... <laughs> Thank you, everybody. That's the show. Have a good night. Bye, everybody. Good Bye. Night. Bye. Bye. Bye.